Hello. I'm here. And one of these days, <laughs> I will actually be late at this rate, but today's not that day. I swear, it's like the last five streams I've, I've like, been ready 30 seconds before it, it hit the time. Alright. He's seasick. I did have the thought, like, does this bobbing motion... I hope it doesn't, like, bother people with motion sickness. Here, I'll get off the buoy. Hello, everybody. I'm ready to game today. I don't know if you ever... I had, you had one of those days where it's, like... You know, long day. Long past couple of days, to be honest. But... I'm ready to just go off right now and <laughs> play some... Let's play some Spider-Man, am I right? Just take him to Lady Liberty. That would take a little long. I do want to get started. Here, let me do a homemade spinning pile driver. Oh, look, we're spinning! Oh, I got him. Oh, I killed him in one hit for some reason. I love how fall damage accrues in this game. Alright, let's get going. The run count is going into the future, 2025. So, I actually did a little bit of practice uh, before the stream starts. I'm not sure if I want to do what I practiced in runs today. I'm not sure if it's ready. But it's like halfway there, you know what I mean? I've been practicing art, new art gallery strats, and they're really, really hard. <laughs> well, sequel time already, huh? But Welcome I was back. starting to get them. Sure I was starting to get it towards the end. Um, but I don't think I'm quite there yet. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see how I feel. Uh, before we go any further, I think I'll probably decide in the moment whether to use them or not. But they're, they're, they they're actually do feel really good to hit. Flying cars? Did you see flying cars? Oh no. Dr. Connor's class. I got so caught up in what I was doing, I forgot all about it. Believe I'm running so late. Still, I should be able to make it as long as. Help me! Right on cue. Looks like I was almost there. Complete the game without swinging. Oh, I've got good news for you, Aussie. You might want to check. Uh, go to my channel page and take a look at some of my videos if you want to see a swingless run. Case secure. I really don't have time for this. Hi, my name's. Maybe I can still make it before class ends. Yeah, I've been doing swingless for. I think this might be a good probably like six or seven years now, right? The white dot on your map here and the white destination marker are both pointing you. Yeah, it's all good, Aussie. In fact, I'm more, I'm more I was more just excited to be able to say that I've already done that. I blame that on the lag frame, legitimately. Yo, Christopher Butcher. I'll never forget um, when I when I discovered how to do swingless. I'll never forget that like moment. Because I had been theorizing it for a while, but I, I was just looking for, like, the missing link, and then I remember when I found it, I was like, holy shit. Although I think the biggest discovery pop-off I ever had was when I discovered slide cancel kicks, which is kind of funny because they don't save that much time in the run. They are really, really cool, though. Yeah, the fact that Good. Swingless Statue of Liberty is possible oh. at all is fucking wild. Burn off some calories or I won't fit my costume anymore. My original idea on how to do Swingless Statue of Liberty was to somehow spawn an enemy and do like the infinite jump using the enemy to fly all the way there. But there was no way to spawn an enemy, so... Yo, some schmuck. I must be out of my mind. Spider 
man. Hang on. I gotta remember how to do the old strat. Hang on. This feels. I gotta practice this on console too. This feels so different. Hope your insurance is paid up. New shot sooner or later. Sorry, gentlemen. The gallery is closed. It feels like slower on console. I don't know how to just. That's weird. That feel. That's a weird feeling. <laughs> Gonna lurk. I respect it. Thanks for the good luck. Yo, Strudel. I'm glad your PC is working. I think that's the reason why, if possible, I prefer to practice on on console because it, it it really does feel different than emulator. Hey, I want to ask you some questions. Ouch. I'd better move a little faster. I obviously can't count on her charity. Damn, even with your PC fix, you're getting YouTube stream buffer. That's rough. I've never had that issue, luckily. Yo, Lila. Yeah, I've always had way more issues with the Twitch stream player, so it always surprises me. I guess the, the ratio of people complaining about the player really hasn't changed since I streamed on Twitch, so... I guess it about evens out. Yeah, I think for my purposes, Twitch is worse. I think it really just depends on what you value as a streamer or viewer. Whatever it is you do. I think these days they're pretty similar. I would, but it infringes on lawyer man's turf, and you wouldn't believe how ticked he gets. Who's with that girl? Yo, legend. You know, this chapter opening reminds me of something. The Spidey store gets new items every time a new chapter starts. Aha! Next time you have a chance, visit the store and check out what they've got. Speedrun the game using the ragdoll mod. <laughs> I wonder what some of the combat would even be like. I'm being teleported. It's always fun. Hi, Pete. I think that's the... You can move while ragdolling. That would be funny. I mean, if you if you think about it, you're you're always moving while ragdolling, just you know, wherever the game sends you. What's up with this Beck guy? That's some like, <laughs> that's like the same logic as like, oh well, actually the Earth spins at three miles per hour, three hundred thousand or what is it, three thousand miles per hour. So like, you're technically moving right now. It's like, shut up, dude. <laughs> we know. <laughs> you should post the the interview publicly, Isla. If you if you want, I mean, it's up to you. I guess at the end of the day. But I don't see why I should get the the exclusive treatment. I have enough trouble without someone trying to convince thugs that I don't have powers. Oh, this you watched two of my all races PBs back to back, like the most recent two, or were you digging deep in the archives? How are you?
Yeah, I guess it's up to you at the end of the day, Lila. Rick Dolling, when you get hit, always cheers you. Yep. I do feel like it's hard to be mad when your character is ragdolling like a goofball. Definitely possible, but it's harder. So much for you. I'm starting to see why rhinos are endangered. The PB last week got me fired up to do grind more grinding. Kinda. Sometimes it was one of those ones where I PB'd and I was like, holy shit, I can beat this. Like I can do even better than that. If you only knew. I also kind of wanted to do more grinding, if that makes sense, even before the PB. So I figure if I got more in the tank, might as well. Way too high with that. I don't know why I thought I needed all that height. Does it always take three cycles to beat Rhino? If you do it right, it's definitely possible to mess it up and do four cycles. I can't believe I. I'd say that only happens to me like I don't know. I give it like three percent of the time. Like it happens, but not very often. But yeah, there's no like, there's no like RNG that can cause you to get four cycle if you do, if you do it right. I should have boosted that. Yo, Michael. Right now we're just warming up, but. I kind of already feel a little warmed up. I, maybe it's because I practiced before the stream. I guess I, I don't feel completely warmed up, but I'm like... 20% more warmed up than I feel like I would be otherwise. I think it's because my hands aren't cold. I'm so used to starting the stream and my hands are cold for the first, like, hour. Hey kid, how you making out? Listen, I got a new job for you to do, okay? There's these things called photo op tokens that I want you Thanks to Thanks for the good luck, Oblivion. Mark them on your map just to spell it out real plain for you. Now get to work. And hello, Melodrama. Sorry, I'm just catching up on chat. I, I often wonder if it's weird when I do things in, like, reverse order, but that's just, that's you know, I read bottom up. What do I do to warm up? Usually nothing. Usually the stream is the warm up, but today I was doing a little bit of practice before... And by practice, I was more... It's not practice if I'm... It's more like I'm learning a new strat. <laughs> so... But I... The way that you learn it is by practicing, so... You know, I guess it's both. How do you do the Rhino trick? So, on my channel, there is a video called... I, this isn't the exact title, but something like Slide Cancel Kicks. Like, slide as in a thing you slide it down. Um, go find that video and it'll, it'll show you how to do it. But the gist of it is you get them stuck against a wall and then you push towards the wall and attack and then like the stick reset to neutral and then repeat that. And you can kick basically as fast as you want or as fast as your hands can go. Because sliding against the wall cancels Come the back. kick and, and then lets That's you do another one. Yeah, that glide's so fun. It's like not even super hard either once you know the set once you like kind of figure out the setup. Follow the speedrun route but at your own pace. That's a good way to learn too. I mean if, even if you're not like going for anything, but like if you are going for to learn the speedrun, that's like a good way to learn it. It's just kind of, you know, like, even, like, sit down with a notepad 
and just and just like kind of follow along with the speedrun. Write some shit down. Uh, wait, shit. Wait, hang on. Nope. There's no salvaging that in an easy way. I'm chasing Black Cat. Yes, yeah, this, this game's speedrun is awesome, and if if you're interested, you should try a run. Glad to hear it, Lila. Black Cat seems okay. Maybe a little bit of an attitude, though. Currently, you struggle with getting the mega times. Better change while no one is around. Ooh, bathroom spawn. Now, I yeah, I, I don't think there's like a person alive who didn't at some point. <laughs> Quentin Beck's gonna prove I'm a fake. Huh? I've talked about this before, but there there's been one time in my life where I broke a controller, and you know what it was over? It was over um that one mega time in Central Park, Ready, where you have to. I forget which one it is. You like wall jump up of a building and then go up really high and then do an orbit and then go up really high again. I forget which one that is. That kid me broke my PS2 controller over that. Do you like my gadgets, Spider-Man? I perfected the technology on the movie Sorority Jet Robot. Because I think I had gotten every other Mega Time. <laughs> I just couldn't do that one. But your education must have been special. 107 sounds right. That that sounds right to me. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that is it. Because 104 is the really long one. It wasn't that one. I figured out that one somehow. I'm better than you, Spider-Man. And today, I'm going to prove it. Uh-oh. That guy's going in. He's totally going in. I have absolute faith in him. I was right to believe. These guys better have their sentences reduced. Okay, here's my question. You, you Let's say that you got 10 years in jail. They're, they they go, go up to you and they're like, we'll take two years off your sentence, but you gotta do this. Do you do it? I think I would do it. If you look at the texture in there, it's like padded. So like, at worst you're probably like breaking a bone. And you get to beat Spider-Man. <laughs> oh fuck, wait, hang on. I can't believe I fucked up like that. And I got flipped again. Yes. That, that ain't happening. Okay, that's the warm-up run. Now we go for real. To be in the clutches of Spider-Man's arms. To be honest, you're you're with the way I play, the chances that you actually get to be held by Spider-Man are pretty low. You're probably just getting like 30 feet away from him and getting yanked into the pit. Well, sequel time already, huh? Welcome back, I guess. First things first. Uh, before we go any further, I think it might be a good idea. Now here's the thing. I think if I'm one of those prisoners, I want to get grabbed by by Beck. It seems like he's a lot more gentle than at least I am in the speedrun. He just kind of picks you up and drops you in. But Spider-Man like yanks you, and sometimes he like bank shots you in off the stone off the like stone floor, or whatever that is, concrete maybe. 
believe I'm running so late. Still, I should be able to make it as long as... Help me! Right on cue. Blast! I was almost Fire. there, too. Sorry, Dr. Connors. Spider-Man hero! Get rid of him and get... It was almost a normal fight. Case secure. What the fuck is this guy doing? Oh, he like almost clipped into the ground there. Did you see that? Hi, my name is... Maybe I can still make it before class ends. 52, 59 seems like the warm up. That's that's how you gotta think of it. I'm just getting started. I think this might be a good time for you to check your to-do list. It'll show you the white dot on your map here and the white destination marker are both pointing you to the pizza park. You'll need to get over there at some point, but there's no rush. It's like the mentality of the trophy, like... I've heard of athletes who, you know, they have like a trophy case. And when they get a trophy, they leave it there for like... I don't know, a couple weeks, a couple months, whatever, however long, and then they put it away. They put it, like, in a closet or something. Because they don't want to see the trophy anymore, because they know they can, they want to do it again. They want to keep improving. And if you're just looking at that trophy all day, all you're thinking about are past accomplishments, not what about, not what you're gonna do in the future. That class must have been really short. Yeah, let's be real. Spider-Man's gone for like a couple minutes. He was barely gonna make the end of class, <laughs> if that, even if that interruption didn't happen. At my birthday dinner, I promised MJ I was meet her this evening. I gotta hurry. I can't believe I ran off like that. I must be out of my mind. You ever struggle with motivation? I mean, it happens. I'm not, not at the moment, but like, it's definitely happened in the past. And all that I, all that I have to say about that is it's good to take breaks, it's good to like, try other categories. At the end of the day, you just gotta like, Keep wanting to improve, I guess. And understanding that it's like all part of the process is part of it too. And then my other piece of advice is while you have the, the motivation, you hold on to it and take it for what it's worth. But don't overdo it. There's a balance there. If you overdo it, you burn out. If you underdo it, the motivation goes away by itself. Because you're not doing anything with it. You miss your window. Hey! Why were you at the art gallery? I chuck it up to undying optimism. Huh? What does she mean by that? Well, unless I can shrink her lead, I'm never gonna find out. When did I first play this game? I mean, as a kid, I couldn't tell you the year, but I, I want to say it was probably a year after it came out, something like that. Like 2005. Like, it was still pretty new. Alright, see you, Legend. Thanks for stopping by. We're at the point in the game where there's still more to learn, or where the runner needs to be cracked. I would say yes to both. <laughs> I'm literally in the middle of uh, learning a new strat um, that's not quite ready for to be used in runs. But you need to be really good to get a 52, not to toot my own horn. But that shit's hard. I'd say anybody who can get under like a 58 these days is like is really really good. I mean if you get sub one hour you're 
you're definitely really good, but you know, there's like, there's levels. And then every minute after like 58 or 57 just gets harder and harder. And I wouldn't have it any other way. Who was with that girl? Who was she? You know, this chapter opening reminds me of something. The Spidey store gets new items every time a new chapter starts. Aha! Next time you have a chance, visit the store and check out what they've got. But I'd also I'd say it's probably easier to get into than it was when I started, despite it being so much more optimized. Like, you could talk to people, there's guides, actual guides that exist now. Hi, Pete. Run video quality is <laughs> better, so you can actually watch them easier. But it's funny because I never really stopped playing this game. Like, you know, I played it as a kid, and then I kind of played it on and off until I discovered speedrunning. Like, there was kind of always that desire to play it more, but, like, I was... I needed a reason why, you know what I mean? Like, I would just go on every few months and, like, swing for an hour or two, and then I would just kind of set it down. I did not jump far enough, did I? Oh, the backup glide. <laughs> that was actually really cool. It's going pretty good, Will be. I have oh, enough trouble. The disc didn't work. I am um I mean fingers crossed this continues forever, but very blessed right now that my disc I, I've like never had an issue with this disc. I've had an issue with Xboxes. I've had to swap out Xboxes, but I've never had an issue with disc. Which Damn, I got those. Lucky for you, I pull my punch. <laughs> what a place to dodge that. Please die. Thank you. It's a cool chapter time. It is really funny when I think back to the first time I played it, because I I played it with, like, my friend. And I remember us talking about the game after we finished, and we were like, yeah, it was kind of long. Like, it was a little too long. <laughs> and I was like, I know. I know a way to make it shorter. I guess that's where it all started. I, I remember it took eight hours to finish the first time. I can't believe I actually I love to meet Dr. just finding games. I feel like that's a u almost universal experience as a kid is like somehow acquiring games for free through coincidence. Like, um, this is actually a more recent example, but a, wh a while back I bought, or you know, you know what it was? My friend acquired an Xbox 360 for like a, a yard sale? I don't remember how exactly, for like five bucks, like really cheap. And he was like, you want this? I was like, sure, and there was just a copy of Call of Duty Black Ops in there. 
just hanging out. Although an older tale is um, when I was walking home after school, at the school bus, just lying on the street was a copy of NSYNC. What was it? It was like NSYNC Make It to the Show or something like that. <laughs> I forget the actual title, but it, there was an NSYNC Game Boy Color game. I didn't know what the fucking NSYNC was. I was just like, oh, sweet, free Game Boy game. <laughs> And I played, tried to play that in for like 20 minutes. But when you're a kid, that's like awesome. And sync get to the show. I think that's what it was called. And I don't think I would have learned that there was an N sync Game Boy game, otherwise. But that's also why I got Pokemon Yellow as a kid was. My dad worked at like an arcade type place and some kid left it there and never came back for it, so I got it. So thank you, random kid. If you if you if one of you ever lost your, your Pokemon yellow at like a local arcade like twenty years ago, thank you. I I really appreciate it. <laughs> You're a real one. <laughs> GBA Super Mario World? I had that one. That's a sick find. Can't do that with, with digital media. You can't randomly find digital media lying on the ground. I guess maybe you could. You could find, like, a month of Xbox Game Pass lying in, <laughs> in the Walmart parking lot. Well, flattery will get you nowhere with me. Found 20 bucks in your apartment parking lot. Damn. <laughs> I want to find 20 bucks in a park in a parking lot somewhere. Try to keep up. I don't like waiting. I don't see you waiting at all. Like she's doing me a favor. I gotta close the gap. Did I just double swing? I think I did. Black cat. Yo, buzzed. These are hella relaxing. Yeah, it's a uh, it's pretty good way for me to unwind sometimes too. Depends on the day. Some days I'm really locked in. Some days I'm I'm just chilling. And today I think it's both somehow. I think it's a similar feeling. Like if if you ever like go on a run to unwind, I think that's it's a similar feeling. This, I gotta say. Except I'm going on a speed run. Ready, Spider-Man? Let's begin. I also went to a local burger place and ate way too much burger today, and I'm still kind of feeling the after effects from that, so this is kind of me recovering. <laughs> Physically. So if I were actually going running, that would be- I would be in pain. Uh, you can tie in this event, and if you do, you instantly lose like a minute in the speedrun, so for me that's an auto reset. It's actually somewhat common for me. It's I would say it's more common for me to tie than lose. I'm better than you, Spider-Man, and today I'm going to prove it. Your parents never hugged you, did they? 
I'm not gonna throw up on stream, don't worry. <laughs> I'll be fine. <laughs> You don't know that? I do. I'm after this I am positive. That's all of them. Yeah, like if I... Also, like, if I get sick, I'm not gonna... I'm gonna leave. I'm gonna be like, okay, sorry guys, I feel sick. And then I would... Turn off the stream and leave and go deal with it. I'm not just gonna like let it get that bad. Also, like, I feel like if I threw up on stream, you get like banned for that, don't you? Someone asked what the burger looked like. No, that's that's not how digestion works. <laughs> it doesn't. The burger definitely would not look the same going out as it did coming in. If it did, I would be even more concerned. Nice platforming, thanks. Alright, I'm gonna stop talking about throwing up. I don't wanna be gross on the stream. <laughs> We're gonna move on. Don't unhinge your jaw. Is that a thing that people can do? Is that like being double jointed? Some people can just do that shit. I remember being told that when I was in like elementary school by another kid and believing it. Because the kid was double jointed. Your brother was terrified of Mysterio and, le and just left the Speedy Mart. The funny part is, the Speedy Mart's door is sometimes unlocked and sometimes not. And it's really rare for it to be unlocked. So that you could leave. Way. Not now. Whoa. It's about a little consideration for other people's time. It's like you have something against me. You okay? I mean, I think you can go into that speedy mart whenever you want. Take off, guys. I'm not oh, see, I think it just is kind of there. Stopping? I guess I finally have your attention. If I have to stick around, you guys do too. Great. Finally, maybe I can still make it before the end. Feels like I never get away from that sniper. He's like, he, he's like shooting me eighty percent of the time these days. He was, he is helping out more, but he's also shooting me. He's just, he's very chaotic lately. He can't make up his mind. Maybe so. Overall, that's in my mind. That's maybe that's not quite a homie sniper. That's like a that's like a acquaintances bordering on friends sniper. You know what I mean? Like we kind of we know each other and we we get along well, but like he's a little sketch. So I don't know if I want to like hang out with him one on one, but like in a group setting, I would. I would say that that's still friends. That, that, that's friend sniper, but maybe not homie sniper. You, you, you get what I'm saying?
Yeah, buddy sniper. Like he shoot he shot me in the face. Sure. But he also saved like three seconds on the speedrun, so like, can you blame him? Lethargic? You're the one weaving like a drunken sailor. Uh, the sniper can shoot the comrades. It seems to prioritize... Like, I'm surprised that he didn't shoot the guy that I was comboing there, to be honest. I don't really know why that didn't happen, but it seems way hard to do, but it does happen sometimes. You beat up his friends. You don't know that those are his friends. He could have just happened to be in that tr in that truck when they drove it. And he didn't even know them. Oh. oh my god, just... <laughs> Take all my health, why don't you? <laughs> <laughs> Just take it all. <laughs> well, chapter nine is gonna be a little tense. Cat took that statue right in front of me. We're green, though. <laughs> Challenge. Can you hold can you survive and keep the green run? Hi Pete. It's an appropriate emote. <laughs> Guess I'd better get going. That news conference is gonna I'm glad I added that one. I think the low health emote's a banger. Oh. Yeah, the aliens may kill me. There's no butt. It just might happen. I guess the butt is they might not. Maybe I'll just game on them and they won't be able to, they won't be able to kill up with me. Are so good. <laughs> oh, the last one. Point blank to the dome, and they're out. <laughs> that was a fun run. I'm not, I'm not too sad about that. I feel like I played pretty good. Just joined watch on two, two times speed to catch up. Better see a new PB. Oh, if you're still catching up, then, uh, then that run is going great. I don't know why which... Obviously, you know what happened by the time you get here, regardless. As for the PB, I'll do my best. Well, sequel time already, huh? Welcome back, I guess. First things first. Uh, before we go any further, I think it might be a good idea to save your progress. If you could call it that. Just go to the pause menu and bring up the save load screen. It's easy, right? Well, then do it. Are those the fabled sorority death robots? That's a good point. Are those just like leftover robots? Oh no. Dr. That he made for that movie. I got so caught up in what and I if doing, yes, why the fuck did Mysterio so make actual functioning robots for a movie called Sorority Death Robots? 
That's awesome. Right on cue. Boy, I was almost Goodbye. there, too. Sorry, Yo, Cam, 26 months? That's a lot of... I know I say it's a lot, that's a lot of months. Thanks for staying on. Should PB real quick, I missed the last one. Okay. Yeah, let me let me do that real quick. Hang on. Yeah, we're, we are officially in the future on run count. I guess we could pretend that it's not the future anymore and be like, hey, remember in 2027 when... I don't know, but something that would happen in 2027. When the trees gained sentience and fought back? I don't know. PS8. <laughs> Car boost, kind of a bad one because my angle is bad, but it was still fun. This is a good time to talk a little about hero. You already know that you use no. I think um Sony should do a Microsoft and just skip a number. Just be like, yep. This is the PlayStation 7. You got plenty of options to do stopping Except instead of Microsoft, they like they just like don't have a reason. They just felt they just didn't want to. Maybe they would. Is, hang on, isn't... I think the number 7 is, like, kind of taboo in Japan? Or maybe that's 4. I can't remember. <laughs> Man, that cake was maybe they hard. skip it for that reason. I better burn off some calories or I won't fit in my costume anymore. I can't even remember those. Oh, no. At my birthday dinner, I promised MJ I would meet her this evening. I gotta hurry. I think it's seven. I could be wrong. Maybe it's both. <laughs> I can't believe I ran off like that. I must be out of my mind. <gasps> we'll see if they made an Xbox Five divided by twelve. That—that's the new strat, by the way. I'm not gonna do it for all of them, but the strat is to do that on all of them. Hang on, maybe I am doing it all for all of them. I don't decide what my hands do here, they just do whatever. But imagine how cool our gallery is going to be when I do it on all of them. Give me rent. Yo, you some schmuck with a $5 super chat. Slide does a 100% speedrun of Toby 2 in 2027. 20, <laughs> maybe actually. I really want to do one eventually. It's just gonna be so much prep. But yeah, thank you for the super chat. Appreciate it. The sewers the sewer stream was kinda sick, wasn't it? That was really cool. I think that whole stream was kind of just good. <laughs> I'm not sure if it tops the Mythbusters stream as my favorite, but that's like a top fiver, right? Top 10 for sure. to slow down i'd be happy to make yeah. myself available i don't think you even right? necessarily need a good all token route you need just one that you can remember consistently i think that's way more important <laughs> stream spider-man full time i mean i'm i'm already as it is right now past couple of weeks and hopefully this week fingers crossed i've been doing five days a week that's pretty full time to me <laughs> I mean, I don't stream eight hours a day, but I'm not sure, to be honest, I'm not sure that I ever could. I don't know if I have that in me, at least not right now. I would be I would be worried that don't the quality would so decrease because I would get tired. Nope, my 11.30 personally. canceled, so I'm totally free. 
But at least for the moment, I'm kind of doing it part-time. What was with that girl? Who was she? You know, this chapter opening reminds me of something. The Spidey store gets new items every I thought I set the 10k sub goal because I didn't want to do it. I set the 10k sub goal because I didn't want to do it right away. Not that I didn't want to do it. If that makes sense. This should be a safe spot to change. That was just a rude teleport. I, I got like two steps in. Did I have a bowl of Mysterios for breakfast? I think we were talking about this the other day, but I haven't had cereal in a long time. The last time I had cereal, I was, you know, I was in the grocery store and I was like, you know, saw cereal. I was like, yo, I remember cereal. <laughs> I don't sound like a human being talking right now. Hang on. I, so I basically I went and I bought a, like a family size thing of Apple Jacks because we were liking those. And I did like them and I had them. And then I had, an, you know, the next day I had another bowl. And then I had another. And then I was like, good. I was like, I'm good on Apple Jacks, and there's like two-thirds of the box left. So, like, I think that turned me off of buying cereal for the moment. Because I was just like, I just have, there's so much left that I'm like over it. I want to eat cereal like twice a year. You have the two sides of the Apple Jacks camp. Marshmallow Fruity Pebbles? I know that's not like real fruit flavor, but my brain is like, ooh, I don't want to mix marshmallow and fruit. I'm sure it's fine. Oh, this is great. What console is the worst to speedrun this game? Uh, it's either- it's probably GameCube. Uh, but the- you could- there's an argument for some of the slower PS2's models. Cereal or milk first? Depends on the cereal. Most cereals, you do cereal first. But if it's like, if I mean like Frosted Flakes or something, something that like, okay, you pour the milk in and you have like 30 seconds to eat this before it gets soggy. Then you pour the milk and you pour a little bit of cereal in at a time and you eat that before it gets soggy. And then you pour a little more and you eat it before it gets soggy. But if you're eating, like, a normal cereal, then you go cereal first. It's frosted flakes then no milk. I kind of agree with that take too. I can't believe I actually got to meet. Dr. What? You don't like my take? I feel like that's a very nuanced take. I even gave you a strap with my take. Yeah. Half and half creamer instead of regular milk. No, but I do have a, I do have a creamer story where, um, you know, I don't, I never use creamer or drink coffee at all, like, growing up. Um, but my mom did, and one time I was like, I want to make some hot chocolate. And we didn't have any milk, so I used, uh, coffee creamer instead, and later I checked how many, cal how many calories my 
my hot chocolate was gonna be with that. It was, it, I forget what it was, but it was, it was like 500 or something like that, just for hot chocolate. With that, it was good though. I just would be like, holy shit. Kid, how you making out? Listen, I got a new job for you to do, okay? There's these things called photo op tokens that I want you to find. I've marked them on your map just to spell it out real plain for you. We play both sides. Aw, oh, shit. I'm a serial. Oh, no. <laughs> what a bonk. I'm a serial centrist. I can't believe it. That is my actual take. I didn't. I didn't say it just to take us to, to not take a side. What just happened? I bonked on the corner, which I probably could have reacted to that a little better. But that, even so, I don't know how well I would have done. Never look at calories. I. I don't think it's good to obsess over them, but it's good to like. Keep it, keep it in mind, you know what I mean? And there are those that, you know, do calorie counting and are very successful and, you know, healthy about it. I just think it can also be easy to, like, obsess a little bit much over it. much brain matter as Spidey lost from all the times he splattered on the ground. I mean, Spider-Man's pretty durable, right? That's probably the equivalent of me, like, laying down on my pillow for him. <laughs> Maybe not. <laughs> it's important to have a healthy relationship with food. Definitely helps. I don't get you. Last time you were an ice queen, but now you're friendly. Make up your mind. I do my best. Sometimes me and food fight. Usually we get along. Sometimes we get along a little too well. Oh. The web zip off the other thing. Spider-Man 2, Spider-Man lost his power and fell like 200 feet onto an air duct and his only reaction was, uh, weird. I think that's proof that he didn't actually lose his powers, he just got like, what's it called? Yips? Is that what it's called? Black Cat seems okay. Maybe a little bit of an attitude, though. Well, no one's around, I better Because if I fall 200 place. feet onto an air duct, I wouldn't think how weird because I wouldn't think I'd be dead. So Quentin Beck's gonna prove I'm a fake, huh? This I got. It. Yeah, I think I feel like uh, Black Cat was included to kind of stand in for Peter, you know, losing his powers to have that like connection. Spider-Man, let's begin. Yips, what is that? I mean, you can look it up. It's nothing weird. It's just like a psychological condition that happens to athletes sometimes. I'd say it could happen to gamers too. Well, that guy has left orbit. Do you like my gadgets, Spider-Man? I perfected the technology on the movie Sorority Death Robot. I don't know about your effects, but your education must have been special. Be thinking my back? Oh, my back. No, I'm, t I'm sorry. I don't got that in me. I know some people can survive, miraculously survive height, falls from great heights. That's not me. I die when that happens to me. A hundred percent of the time. Today, I'm going to prove it. 
That guy better go in. He did. Have I ever tried it? Yeah, I died. <laughs> I had to respawn. I got that Dark Souls 2 fall damage calculation. Continue okay. What if one time it said not okay? What would happen then? I don't think any of us would even notice. We need to recognize its cry for help. You think when you die in real life, you see the Dark Souls you died before respawning in your bed? I don't have an answer for you, but it does remind me of something that scared the shit out of me when I was a kid. I was like, I was like, what if save slots are real, and you save every time you go to bed, and then you die, and like, you know what I mean? Like, let's say you die of old age, then you load your recent save, which was when you went to bed last night, and then you just die again. That scared me. That, that thought, like, fucking terrified me as a kid. I was like, I don't want... <laughs> I was like, I don't want saves to be real. You gotta have multiple saves. That's the thing, is, is I'm like, what if it's like an auto-save, you know what I mean? Like, if, the, if I get to choose when I save, that's one thing. Like, yeah, I'd be a little scared of fucking it up, but like... I feel like you just gotta co hard commit to, like, saving when you're, you know... When you're, like, 15, and then loading that when you die. And just going again. And then never saving over that slot, no matter what. But if it's an autosave, then it just happens. You can't do anything about it. But then again, what if there's New Game Plus? I feel like that'd be kind of neat. My head is still spinning from talking to him. Oh no. Mary Jane is playing. If I hurry, I can still make it in time. What skills do you carry over? Like, all your gaming stuff, all your knowledge... Any, like, you know, motor muscle memory you had. But you're just, like, in a, in, in a young body again, so you get to be, be good at it. Not now. Looks like interference show. Aren't diamonds forever? Couldn't you have waited a day? Trust me, you're getting off easy compared to me. Weird fight. You okay? You're scared of going back to a younger age? Yeah, I feel like it'd be scary at first, but for a while you'd be like, this is actually kind of nice. I guess I finally have your attention. Great. Finally, maybe I can still make That is a nothing sniper. That guy did absolutely nothing to help or hinder. You know what would suck though? If I go back to being like 15, there's no way that I'm doing good in school again. I mean, at, at first, I, I feel like I get the hang of it, but like, you, you put me back in my high school math class, I'm like, what the How fuck is this? Is this place? Not too far. Stay with me. Like, I have to figure out what the formulas do. Just type sign in, in the code and figure it out. You're getting a lot better at following me. 
I will say when when I graduated college, um, going easy on you before. Or like months afterwards, I would wake up scared that like I was forgetting an assignment, <laughs> and I'm like, this wasn't that. <laughs> that was like that's like not a healthy thing. <laughs> I'd like wake up and I would be like, I'd be like, I'm late, I'm, 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 assignment, I'm late for it, I'm late, I need to, I need to finish it now. I need, uh, class is probably in like an hour. And I'd be like, oh wait, shit, I, I graduated. <laughs> that probably happened to me like seven or eight times before I, before it stopped. So, uh... Nice night, huh? Yeah, I haven't had it. I haven't. I'm, I don't. I have phases where I dream. Sometimes I dream like every day for like a month, and some days I don't dream. Like I don't think I've had any dreams in probably a couple months that like I remember. Oh my, Spider-Man, I need you to concentrate. to get a web zip out. Found tree. I don't even remember what trigonometry is. <laughs> I did not, I don't know, math was not my thing in school, which is funny because I use it fairly frequently these days. I wish when they were teaching high school level algebra, they were like, hey, this shit's good in programming. Maybe I would I would have paid attention if they said that. Bit more health this time. What are you doing back here, dude? <laughs> dude is hiding. Where did he go? <laughs> he was just here a second ago. Wait, I can't. I have to get this guy first. Oh my god, this guy is trolling. I got camped in Spider-Man 2. Camped in my favorite video game. Even as we speak, my armada is advancing on your city. Our first target will be your Statue of Liberty. You have no chance to survive. Make your time. <laughs> Build a time machine and find the guy who invented math. Ah, uh, yes, George Math, inventor of math. If he's attacking Lady Liberty, I'd better get over there in a hurry. Man, 
Mysterio knows how to make a team. We better figure out some way to get Lady Liberty back to her old self. Looks like that flying thing above the stack. Hey. How much faster I am on this stream than I was in the, the Ragdoll stream. Yeah. I still got it in me to play slow every once in a while. I don't know, I still like, like I, I know why that happens, but it doesn't feel any better knowing why. That was like on pace to be super good. Do I ever find myself speedrunning when I try to play it really slowly? Not usually. Sometimes it happens when I'm doing more casual stuff for this game. I like... The most common thing is that I accidentally skip cutscenes. Because my, my hands just tell me to do something and skip the cutscene. Wow. Mysterio's hidden fortress looks just like an apartment. Yeah, Robert, this game's charge jump is so sick. Well done, Spider-Man! Please, come inside and discover the horrors that await you! Go to the barrel. I can't, I'm... Well, I kind of... It's like Schrodinger's time. Like, depending on how it goes, I may, might lose time if I go to the barrel first. Because if I get the clip, then I, on? then I would be losing time by not getting the clip. Oh, I, I guess I don't need the health. I mean, I actually kind of don't. On a run like this, it legitimately might be worth the frames. Cause like this, this run needs is gonna need all the help it can get. Looks like I found the exit. Finally. Need more AR code journeys. Yeah, I mean. I'm finally out of that crazy place. I don't really know how to make any cool AR. I can make some. I have some amount of AR code familiarity, but I'm nowhere near the level that Nate is. So, thank Nate for that. But it's always cool when there's a new one drops for me to mess around with on stream. NG plus run. Oh, the coded G plus one. I'm sure I'll eventually do that. I'm always worried to do anything that like changes the movement these days. Because I'm afraid I'm going to lose my muscle memory. I mean, Nate's been cooking lately. Whoops, Dr. Octavius is demonstration. But, you know, we can't you can't rush art. I mean, you can, but you you probably shouldn't. How do you make AR codes? I think uh, Google probably has a better answer for you than I ever could. Not trying to dismiss the question, I just don't think I would have a good answer. But it involves addresses and numbers and hexadecimal. I have to hurry. The containment field looks like it's buckling. I don't have time for subtlety. <laughs> I just have to smash the power terminals until the reactor. Wait, I'm alive? Eh, fuck it.
That run wasn't anything special anyways. That's funny. Alright, let's run it back. Did you see... To be fair, my spacing before the bonk was immaculate. Did you see how close I was to that hitbox without getting hit? I was in the force field and doing fine. Well, sequel time already, huh? Welcome back, I guess. First things first. You suck, you keep dying. So true. Uh, before we go any further, I think it might be a good idea to save your progress. If you could call it that. Just go to the pause menu and bring up the save load screen. Is that what happens if Spider-Man dies there? It just goes out of control? Is that the lore? Just NYC dies right there. Oh no. Dr. Connor's class. I got so caught up in what I was doing, I forgot all about it. I can't believe I'm running so late. Still, I should be able to make it as long as... Help me. If you rearrange re the word subtlety, you get right butt you. sly. I was almost like there, too. I'm just gonna believe you and not bother mentally checking. That's awesome. Spider-Man! Incredible! Get that tank! Batter up! Gate secure! Otto's character was changed. To be honest, like I don't really remember the movie enough to, like, get the subtleties of how his character was changed. I know he does kind of a different voice in this, but I feel like I'm not really the one to ask. I'm not the expert on that. I'm gonna, but I, I'm gonna make a take anyways and say it's awesome and the movie should have been like that too. <laughs> Do you disagree? Discuss. I don't think I PB'd while you were gone. Unless you were gone for like two weeks. This is a good time to talk a little about hero. But I've I've definitely seen you around since then, so no. Oh, you don't? Well, then you weren't paying attention. Naturally, you're gonna want to earn lots. No, what? Get me up there. Plenty of options to do it: stopping crimes, helping citizens in distress, challenges, collecting items. Promise to remind MJ that I would meet them this season. Some other ways too, so try. I didn't even notice we have access glitch. Look at that. So mysterious. Nothing happened. I do think it would be kind of cool if that actually, if that prompt actually worked, if you got it stuck like that. I'd better burn off some calories or I won't fit in my costume anymore. I can't even remember the last... Oh no! At my birthday dinner I promised MJ I would meet her this evening. I gotta hurry. Yeah, the world record is always at the top of the splits. I can't believe I ran off like that. I guess maybe for some people on mobile or low resolutions, it might be hard to read. Hopefully it's not an issue for anybody. I can't... I don't know if there's anything I can do to help. Holy shit, I did it. New strats. Can I do it over here too? Oh, I'm gaming! Never mind, gaming has stopped. But I was, I was gaming there. That's probably the best I've done that. I feel like even in practice I wasn't doing it that good. That's hard. <laughs> I don't know if that looks hard, but that's like, that's tough. That's a lot of buttons.
You ever feel like you've had dreams and seen them, but can't remember anything? That's just like how sleeping works. Because <laughs> you just have dreams and then forget them. I would say that most most of the time, I just like I remember dreams for like five seconds, and then they're gone. I don't remember that Aussie, but I wouldn't be surprised if there was like some Spider-Man Flash game that was like that. Feel free to slow down. I'd be happy to make myself available for your admiration. If I don't close distance with her soon, she's gonna get away. That wall jumps so hard. Was Peter studying? Wasn't he like oh, chemistry or something? Leather. Doesn't that kind of chafe? You'll never find Isn't that why he could make like webbing and shit? I mean, I guess in in universes where he does that. Who was she? You know, this chapter opening reminds me of something. The Spidey store gets new items every time a new chapter starts. Aha! Next time you have a chance, visit the store and check out what. The fact that you go shopping and still wind up in front of her is dis peak disrespect. It's even more disrespect because you still have you have so much time to spare. That's also not the last time you go shopping during the chase in the run. Hi, Pete. I think that's the. I appreciate keeping up with the high Betty. It's rude, <laughs> otherwise, although I never do it. What's up with this Beck guy? How can he possibly claim I'm a I'm so glad the uh, the Empire State Building needle isn't like 10 feet taller, because then that jump would be like 10 times harder. <laughs> You think life is like with the citizens with how it's constantly fast forwarding between night and day? That's probably normal for them. I'm sure they were like, what if time didn't fluctuate? Wouldn't that be weird? If anything, it's probably either nice when it happens sometimes or annoying when it happens, because it's like, oh, I just got in for my eight hour shift, but time fluctuated, so I'm I'm leaving, I guess. And I still get paid, so... But sometimes it's like, oh, why won't time fluctuate already? Yeah, this is just what happens in New York City. Ask any New Yorker about the about about how time is convoluted, and they'll be like, yep, anyways. <laughs> and then they'll tell you what the best hot dog in town is, I presume. Is time really changing, or just the sky? No, it's time. Sometimes time freezes, too. Oh, 
and red dives over a pool table and freaks it, and then leaves. Spite not only just that, Spider-Man dives over a pool table and then takes the the shiny floating four foot tall gold token and just fucking books it out of there without saying anything. I'd be pissed if I was a manager. Your employer comes your employee comes over like uh boss, uh Spider Man just came in again? Yeah, and let me guess, he took the he took the token. Yeah. God damn it. We're running really low on these. Alright, bring bring another one out. I just heard Spider Man uh reset the speed run. Get ready. They hear Rhino getting the shit beat him out beat out of him outside, and they're like, ah here shit, here we go again. If you choose to, believe, you choose to believe the tokens aren't visible to the citizens, that's what makes more sense, but the other way is funnier. I guess it, it's also pretty funny the concept of Spider Man, like, hallucinating <laughs> these tokens. Spider Man jumps over your pool table, just stands there, and is like, oh, hell yeah, 250 hero points. And then the people in the bar are like, what is a hero point? And then he leaves. And a, a but just as a bunch of people spawn in to rob the place. Oh. How much more fun would life be with tokens to collect IRL? I mean, that sounds like a fun idea, right? But imagine you're 149 out of 150 tokens in, and you don't know where the last one is, and they could just be anywhere in the world. Also, imagine how annoying token collectors would get, where it's like, you're just like trying to enjoy your lunch and some fucking horde of token collectors come in because there's a token right next to your your booth at the restaurant and they and they they want it for their collection and then you have like token you tiktokers you know token hunting in public places i don't know i think i, I think it would get old <laughs> I guess that's basically what Pokemon Go was, huh? When it was, like, really big. You do know I'm chasing you, right? I was very fast. Never mind. Okay, I, I, I like saved it at the end. That was almost a colossal failure. Seems okay. Maybe a little bit of 150 the oh. token is in some dude's basement. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like this would not be good. Thanks for good luck on the run. 
So Quentin Beck's gonna prove I'm a fake, huh? This, I gotta see. Ready, Spider-Man? Let's begin. All right, see you, Quincy. Have a good one. I didn't do nothing, I swear. Now that I think about it... Okay, wait, hang on. That guy said, hey, I didn't sign up for this, which could mean one of two different things. Either he didn't sign up for it like we always talk about, like the prisoners, you know, volunteering to do this, or like, you know... Or more likely, what I think he means is, hey, I didn't sign up for this, as in I signed up for something else. Like, you came up to me with an offer, but it wasn't this. Either way... That makes me feel like, um, like the prisoners are <laughs> being taken advantage of even more here. Yeah, Beck lied to them. And there's also the line like, I'll get you for this, Beck. Like, these guys got duped. Beck was probably told them that this was going to be like nothing. And then they're, meanwhile, they're getting, like, three concussions. <laughs> and broken bones. I'm after this Why is there three of them? Wait, do I lose? I think I lose. You know, the cool I guess we tie, but... Really yeah. Oh, well. Well, here we are in the last round of inmates, and it's still too close to call. Did not realize he was getting all those points. <laughs> the Spider-Man on Qu versus Quentin Beck poster. That does go hard. It'd be neat if we had like a high quality version of that. I, I did mention ties. Yeah, that was... uh foreshadowing i guess well sequel time already huh welcome back i guess first things first uh before we go any further Oops. I, think <laughs> I, <might be> good <laughs> I forgot that you could do that i was just pressing buttons without thinking about it menu and bring up the spider reflexes nice in this mode you're fast well you get to listen to a new quentin or not quentin back <laughs> Bruce Campbell line. Damaging move. Oh no, Dr. Connor's class. I got so caught up in what I was doing, I forgot all about it. I can't believe I'm running so late. Still, I should be able to make it as long as. Help me! Right on cue. Class. I was Class. almost there too. Sorry, I want to edit a spider reflexes in real life video. Oh, real time. I thought you said, said I thought you said real life. I was like, you mean slow mo? <laughs> Case secure. It's about a career change. I think I have considered whether Hi, you could skip dialogue with that line that Bruce Campbell says. Still make it before class ends. It's just by the time it would it would only theoretically probably be useful in chapter fourteen, and by that point, you've probably already had. I guess maybe not. But even then, I don't. I don't think it actually ended up working. But even if it did, you could. It would like make. All that it would do would would be to make Scuba skip like a second faster. What's the new combat tech I referenced earlier? I did it last run. Um, it's basically just a more intense way of doing art gallery, where instead of hitting them, falling to the ground, and then hitting them again. You hit, swing, and then hit them again. And that sounds simple, but it's actually like 10 times harder. And it's like, probably saves like 3 seconds? I don't know, something like that. If, if done well. Which is why I haven't done it until now. But it's it's also very cool, so I wanted to do it. 
Uh, double or triple web used to be used used in the Quentin Beck prisoner thing. I never used it, but um, other runners did. I can't even remember. But as it is now, it wouldn't really help. It's definitely not worth the time you'd need to go out of your way to buy it. Maybe if it came pre-packaged, it could be useful, but. As it is, it's not really. I can't believe I ran off like that. I must be out of my mind. Yo, Izzy. Right, let's, I'm gonna see if I can do it now. Nope. It's really hard. I was... What I was struggling with in practice was getting the second hit out. Spider-Man! <laughs> yeah, and then you're liable to mess up like that. That probably almost evened out with the amount of mistakes and advancements I made. Floor is lava art gallery, kinda. You definitely touch the floor less if you do it right. Either way, it's a really cool strat, and I'm looking forward to getting better at it. I would say it's a weird thing to call this category optimized, because it, it like kind of is. But there's also so much time to save, you know what I mean? It's just getting harder to save it in a fun way. Like, when you save time these days, you earned it. There's no more free time saves. She's right. If I don't pick up the pace, she's as good as gone. I never noticed this. You can, like, turn around early from a wall jump with a... With a web ball, I guess? Hang on. Yeah, you can. You can do it, like, immediately, too. Like... More fun, useless tech that I just discovered. <laughs> I mean, I can't think of any situation where that would be useful. Don't you have somewhere to be? Nope, my 1130 You can kind of do a similar I'm thing totally with web zip, where you can delay a web zip with a web ball. But, like, why would you do that? <laughs> that one's more fun. Cause you kind of like I don't know. It looks jank. Who was with that girl? Who was she? You know this chapter opening reminds me of something. Ow! <laughs> I hit my hand on my desk every time when I went to go split. Aha! Next time you have a chance, visit the store and check out what they've got. That doesn't happen very often, but I feel like whenever that does happen, I hit it fucking hard. Like that was honestly not even that bad compared to some some of the shit. I've given myself like a bruise doing that. Hi, Pete. I think that's the... We are green. I didn't even think about that. I was too busy being in pain. The things that I sacrificed for this game. It's like, I can just imagine this conversation, like, yeah, yeah, I hurt my hand, uh, speedrunning Spider-Man 2. Oh, like, the inputs are intensive? You, you, you got, like, a uh, um, carpal tunnel or something? I'm like, no, no, I just hit my desk going to split, and, you know, broke some bones. What's up with this Beck guy? How can he possibly claim I'm I do think, if I was still speeding, if I were still running on GameCube, I think I would have hand problems, to be honest. I think that that controller would have destroyed my hands if I were if I were still speedrunning it.
Because that was the main reason I switched. Was my hands were hurting after I would play for like two hours. I have enough trouble without someone trying to convince oh, this thugs is that I... Hi, Pete. How are you? GameCube controller is a great controller. It's just the triggers, uh, with how much you need to press them in this game, it's a lot. Friends think you're referring to PS5 Spider-Man 2. Don't give in. That game's called Marvel Spider-Man 2. This game's Spider-Man 2. They're the one with a different name. <laughs> Of course, then they can hit you with the option select, um, where you're like, oh, I, that game's Marvel Spider-Man 2, I'm talking about Spider-Man 2, and they're like, which one? There's, there's the PC version, the console version, the Game Boy version, the DS version, and then you say, of course I'm talking about the flagship version, uh, the console version. If I were talking about the non-flagship versions, that's when I would specify the console that they were on. And then the, and then you win. <laughs> the end gauge version. You just never played this. No time like the present. You played the N-Gage version inside of a GameStop at a mall in 2005. Did you ever recover? <laughs> Did you get better? <laughs> it ruined me for life. That's funny. I still think it would be really funny to own an end gauge and this game for end gauge. But that's just like such an investment. And like food still costs money. <laughs> so <laughs> should probably prioritize that first. Weird race. Alright, I'm gonna try some shit here. Didn't work. Hey kid, how you making out? Listen, I got a new job for you to do, okay? There's these things called photo op tokens that I want you to find. I've marked them on your map. Gotta do the, the 3D swinging way. section. The engage version is just the Game Boy Advance version, right? Like, they're, it's just like a, a bad port of that. I thought I was close enough there. Oh no, that was about to be so sick until I... right at the very end. We were very vocally excited with every gamer jump. That's how you know you've made it, is when the gamer jump is expected now. Now you need to get excited when I do art gallery strats, strats uh, right? That's where you need to pog. In real life. Come back! 
You have some is that to button do. prompt gonna be go there forever? No, it goes away, as you've seen. It usually, if you get access there, it seems to go away right before you get the first token in the chase. I don't really know why. Please blog. <laughs> Please. Measuring up to, your to be honest, this movement's also really hard, but it's it's in such a jank way that it's like hard to even explain. Like I feel like it looks like I'm fucking up, and I mean I am. It's hard. I don't even know what to do when that happens. I guess this. I'll keep this run for now. We'll see how I'm feeling after chapter seven. Should I? Maybe I should add the 30 second cutoff. I feel like that's worked well before. Okay. Maybe a little bit of an attitude, though. Toby One's like, I should check to see if Toby One's at my theater now. I think that'd be fun. So Quentin Beck's gonna prove I'm a fake, huh? This, I gotta see. What is an N-Gage? So it's kind of like an Ouya. <laughs> but not really. Ready, Spider-Man? Let's stream myself in. watching it. I made a meme that I was gonna play on stream. Um using like 10 seconds of Toby One footage, and I'm too and I'm too afraid to put it on stream. I'm in here now. Okay, I'm resetting. <laughs> we could do better than that. Was Engage a phone? I thought it was just a handheld. Was it also a phone? I think Nick called it a phone earlier. Well, sequel time already, huh? Welcome back, I guess. First things first. Phone console hybrid. I'm gonna. Uh, we go why did I split? I'm gonna splat here. Might be a good idea to save your progress. If Maybe. You I'm like 80% sure that, that I splat here. Bring up the save yep. Easy, right? <laughs> For one moment there, I got a. Oh, I stumbled! Come on! Hang on. It's not cool to lose, like, a second and a half before you even do any inputs. The buffered stumble into the new game. I still can't believe that that happens. It seems to happen after I splat, actually, now that I think about it. So it always leads to a combo of resets. Well, sequel time already, huh? Welcome back, I guess. In the 2030s now, yeah. Getting older. It's gonna be depressing. Uh, before we go any further, I think <laughs> when we hit like the 2070s, 80s, 90s, when it's like, do y'all think I'm still alive? <laughs> But then we hit the we hit further years, and we just get oh, to talk no. about the future and robots Lance. and shit. I got so caught up in what I was doing, I forgot all about it. I believe I'm running so late. Still, I should be able to make it as long as. I wonder if I could hit that guy with a whip ball in the cutscene. That did you see that? I almost hit him. 
I think that's my gonna be my new side goal. Spider-Man's here already! What would even happen? Do you think that he would stay web balled into the fight? Gate secure! Hi, my name Maybe I can still make it before class ends. I think this might be a Just good keep swinging, that's all we can do when time passes by. The white dot on your map here and the white so true. Marker are both pointing you to the pizza park. Sometimes you just you gotta swing. At some point, but no rush. And if you're gonna swing, you might as well be good at it. You have the poster from the guide on my wall. My guide, I think, came without a poster because I, it was used, so the poster was already gone. You already know that you use them to buy stuff from the Spidey store. I don't even know what the poster was like. Was lots of them. You got plenty of options to do it. Stopping crime, building citizens in distress, commissary and MJ challenges, collecting items and delivering pizza. There's some other ways too to try different things and see what you like. You can only be a good guy. It froze. What froze? Your stream? Man, that cake was good. It's all good on my end. I haven't dropped any frames. I burn off some calories, or I won't fit my costume anymore. Give me that jump. It did briefly. Huh. That one might be on, might be YouTube's fault. I gotta hurry. Unless my capture card's fucking up. I can't believe I ran off like that. I'm gonna assume it's that YouTube, because be I haven't dropped any frames. This was a bad idea. We knew it. Oh, I fucked up. And he hit the guy. In this mode, you're faster than the bad guys. You'll see attacks coming from a mile away. You can even do different, more damaging moves. That was another hybrid one. <laughs> I, I did the new strap for like one of them. I don't know. I've never had problems with streaming on YouTube, like, or watching streams. Which is weird because my internet is really inconsistent with a lot of things, but it's not for streaming. Like, uploading or downloading. But, like, web pages, it fucking hates that shit. But if we're all trolling you, then it's very well coordinated because, like, everybody said that. <laughs> YouTube chat doesn't handle links. Be fair, generally shouldn't be posting links in chat. I mean, if if you ask and I say yes. Although I think Nightbot will will nuke you if you try. So. Yeah, I don't have. I mean, if you tried to post something, I, I doesn't bother me. It's that's mostly just, you know, if, for bots that come in that might come in and be like I don't know. Free Spider-Man 2 100% speedrun link here and then link you to virus.com. somewhere to be? Nope, my 11:30 canceled, so That's totally generally free. the situation that I'm trying to avoid, not like, you know, well-meaning individual in chat. <laughs> Yo, I remember the rent bot. 
I'll say something about YouTube. The bots have been leaving me alone since I came back. I'm not sure I've had a single one. You know this chapter opening reminds me of something. That did not used to be the case. New items every time a new chapter starts. Aha! Next time you have a chance, visit the store and check out what they've got. All the world is my dressing room. Hi, Pete. All the bots are in any reply to it on thread on Twitter now. I don't go on Twitter that much, but like that shit seems really bad right now. <laughs> like, how did it get this bad bad? Meanwhile, YouTube's just like a bot for Utopia right now, I don't know. Like, internet's getting dead interneted as we speak. Or, internet. Uh, Twitter's getting dead internet theoried as we speak. There's no way there's more human interaction on that site than bots. What's up with this Beck guy? How can he possibly claim I'm a... The bots only show up on Elden Ring streams. That wasn't 100% true, but there was a very high correlation with me streaming Elden Ring and the bots showing up. I wonder if when the DLC comes out and Mr. Aziz returns, if um, if that's going to be a problem again. Probably not. Probably not. Although it was, it was, it was funny because it didn't happen that much. It would happen like once or twice a stream, and then it was just kind of funny. But if that shit, like... Like... I remember, I don't know if this is still a problem on Twitch, but for a while Twitch had a, pro a botting problem and it got really bad. Where they would just like completely overwhelm the stream. So hopefully that never happens. Take away your credit card. Say good night, Gracie. <gasps> Mr. Aziz is a pimp. Mr. Aziz would never. His only love is his pizza and his customers. He does also love yelling at Peter. <laughs> We've like flanderized Mr. Aziz and he's not even a person anymore. He's just like this creature that loves pizza and serving, giving pizza to people and hates Peter. Been a while since you've seen a token grab that slick, huh? Been a while. I don't usually go for that. Usually it's kind of worth, you know, taking a half second to just grab it and keep going. Instead of going for, like, the really slick ones. But every once in a while I get the lineup and go for it. There's definitely a clever setup for a joke with a Mr. Aziz and bots talk where it's like, my pizza in bio, get it? But I don't, I don't got it in me to make that joke funny. Just imagine that I did though. Favorite pizza? I think if a pizza is good enough, 
Cheese. Just cheese. If the pizza needs it, give me some onions. Give me some... Bacon, maybe? Bacon bits? Pepperoni? A little bit of ranch? A little bit of buffalo, maybe? But, like, if it's, like, a really good, high-quality pizza, just cheese is good. Also, you know, sometimes I'm just, I'm just, I'm not feeling all the toppings, sometimes I just want cheese. Ah, oh, come on. I need, what did I swing on the pole? Like, the light pole there? What kind of cheese? I don't know. Pizza cheese. <laughs> the cheese you put on pizza. I don't even really know what... Is that mozzarella? Is that what they usually put on, on pizza? I'm not an expert on that subject. I'm glad you're liking the streams, Brad. I think it's generally mozzarella that that's on pizza, right? I, I don't even like what else would you put on there? What's the other? Is parmesan? Is parmesan on pizza? All I know is when I go to the grocery store and I buy the four cheese pizza there, I know that that's how many cheese is good it is. I'm like, that's four more cheese than a one cheese pizza. There's no way that's bad. <laughs> that it has to be good. How did they fit that many cheeses in there? All that just so that I didn't accidentally go to the other side and I didn't jump high enough. Told you, I'm telling you that movement's hard. She just oh, toyed. Well, right, I'm gonna lose her if I don't do actually something. mean to do that, but it actually doesn't really matter. Treaded pepper jack. I'm waiting for the day that I understand pepper jack, because I feel like I should like it. I like spicy stuff. It's just like a kind of spicy cheese, right? But something about it. Uh, it just historically has not been for me. I don't see anyone around. Now's I'll take the bathroom spawn me. to make up some time. So Quentin Beck's gonna prove I'm a fake, huh? This I gotta see. Sometimes you think people are too angry about the pineapple thing. I mean, yeah, people go overboard for sure. I like to think most of it's probably in good fun. Pineapple on pizza is not for me, personally. But, to be honest, you give me a choice between pineapple and, like, anchovies, that's an instant... That's an instant pineapple every day. <laughs> That's an easy choice for me. I'm better than you, Spider-Man, and today I'm going to prove it. Did I get that? I think he didn't go in. He didn't. I didn't see the score counter increase. Oh, look, you can look at him. 
There's nothing I can do. You see him? He's like two pixels back there. There's nothing I can do about that. He is stuck. Uh-huh. This might be the longest I've ever seen this take. Normally they at least fall in by now. That was kind of... I mean, that run wasn't incredible, but I was kind of liking it. Yeah, there it goes. That was, what, like 25 seconds? <laughs> you can't move him. His Once Quentin Beck drops him in, his collision's disabled, so there's nothing you can do. You just have to wait for him to fall in. But he's, like, stuck, because the hitbox is, like... It's like a... What, what's what's the name for, like, a 3D when it's, like, a... Like the, like a, the, like the tip of a pencil, whatever that is. That's, like, what the hitbox is. So he's stuck on the tip. That happens sometimes. To be honest, I've gotten... I've been pretty fortunate that nothing too bad has happened in that section lately. That was out of my control, at least. So, as long as that doesn't become a trend, I'm fine with that happening there. A cone. <laughs> I mean, yeah, I, I feel like there's a more complicated name, but maybe not. Well, maybe I'm imagining things. Already, huh? I was looking for some, like, geometry-ass name, you know what I mean? Precipice, maybe. I guess I could have said, uh, wait, hang on. Uh, before we go any further, stalagmite, right? That's the floor one, because stalactite is T for top. <laughs> is that wrong? I hope that's right. Oh no, Dr. Connor's class. I got so caught up in what I was doing, I forgot all about it. That's correct, it. nice. I'm running so late. Still, I should be able to make it as long as... Help me! Ah. Thank you. I was almost there. I was actually was like a second late there. Sorry, Dr. Connors. Take a nap, Zap. Flap! Flap! Spider-Man here already! Get rid of him and get that case! Okay, I could... We could do better than that. I do want to get a run into the late game today. So at a certain point, we're gonna we're definitely gonna do that, but I feel like I'm playing good enough that I can get a good run there, you know what I mean? Yeah, sorry Justin, I I messed it up. I was gonna say lead when you said tip of the pencil. That's funny. Well, sequel time already, huh? Welcome back, I guess. First things first. Uh, before we go any further, I think it might be a good idea to save your progress, if you could call it that. Just go to the pause menu and bring up the save load. Easy, right? Well, then do it. Oh no, Dr. Connor's class. I got so caught up in what I was doing, I forgot all about it. I can't believe I'm running so late. Still, I should be able to make it as long as. One day I'm gonna I'm gonna hit that guy with a web ball. Right on cue. That guy that spawns in there. He's getting sniped one of these days. Spider-Man's here already. Try not to run into my fist with your face. Case secure. He said he got caught up. What, what was he doing? Uh, skipping the tutorial, obviously. <laughs> Hi, my name's. Maybe I can still make it before class ends. What if this game had that kind of meta humor, where it was like, oh, I was too busy doing the tutorial. Now I missed class. I feel like the game would just be worse. Like, no way that shit doesn't get annoying on a, on Replay 300. You'll need to get over there at some point, but there's no rush. To be honest, I think if I hit that guy with a web ball in the cutscene, I think I would lose time. Because I kind of need him to run towards me so I can kill him faster. 
Like, <laughs> I think I would just like lose a second and get nothing out of it, but it would be incredibly cool and funny. So I still want to do it. Naturally, you're going to want to earn lots I also just want to see what would happen. I mean, who knows? Maybe he would just die and it would it would actually save time. He would just die for no reason. Some other ways too, so try different things and see what you like. But you can only be a Or maybe it would just skip chapter 3 entirely for no explainable reason. Man, that cake was good. I'd better burn off some calories or I won't fit in my costume anymore. Oh, I was positive I had the timing down. Oh no. At my birthday dinner, I promised MJ I would meet her this evening. I gotta hurry. What flavor of cake? I feel like they, it was probably just like a. He doesn't mention a flavor, so it was probably just like vanilla or chocolate, right? Just like something like basic. That. I must be out of my mind. Cause if it was like something out of you know out of the ordinary, I feel like you'd be like, oh, that strawberry cake. No, this is the this is the problem with trying to learn new strats in the run. Sometimes it does not work out. I promise that's really hard. Okay. This is going to be a low reset run. We're going for the 30 second cutoff and with the goal of finishing a run. Cuz I need to stop I need to stop like hyper focusing on early game and get some late game practice too. And who knows? Maybe we can get another 52 going. Well, sequel time already, huh? Welcome back, I guess. First things first. Uh, before we go any further, I think it might be a good idea to save your progress. It was his birthday. I imagine he had a, spi a Spider-Man themed cake. I feel like Easy, right? Harry would have gone nuclear if they had a Spider-Man themed cake. Just imagine that from Harry's point of view. Oh, no. Dr. Connor, imagine somebody kills your dad. So caught up in what I was a couple years pass. So and then, like, you're meeting up with your friends that you haven't talked with in a bit. Oh, it's for your friend's birthday. We got the cake. It's a cake themed around the guy who killed your dad. <laughs> I would not be happy. I would be pissed. Hi, my name is I can still make it before class ends. I think this Yeah, Harry like he doesn't make he doesn't make a fuss, but he's like clearly really pissed off. The white destination marker are both pointing you to the yeah. You'll need to get over there at some point, there's no room. Peter and MJ are better friends than that. They wouldn't, they wouldn't do that to Avery. Probably. How did Oscorp explain Norman's death to the world? I mean... Norman... This is a good time to talk a little about Hero Point. Wasn't part of the company anymore, right? I feel like there'd be rumors that, like, they had him killed or something for, like, trade secrets. I don't even know. Like, he leaves the company and then he just disappears off the grid and is never heard from again. Assuming that the public doesn't know that... No, the public doesn't know he was the Green Goblin. Because Harry doesn't know. Yeah, I feel like 
if I'm like a random citizen and I hear that, I'm like, that guy, Oscorp killed that guy, <laughs> is what I would think. I feel like Norman was like about to release a bunch of trade secrets and they killed him. believe I ran off like that. How does that death that report even go? I don't know. That had potential to be amazing, but it was it was fine, I guess. My pace is actually pretty good despite that art gallery. It's just if I I feel like if I hit a perfect art gallery there, I'm like on competing with gold pace. Wait, Sandman knew how Green Goblin died? I don't know my lore. It's been a while. Or if you weren't so far away. Feel free to slow down. I'd be happy to make myself available for your admiration. If I don't close distance with her soon, she's gonna get away. I, yeah, I guess the, the, like, board of directors at, um... <laughs> At Oscorp, the the rumor couldn't have been that they killed Green Go uh, Norman because Green Goblin killed them. <laughs> you know what? Green Goblin killed all of them. Maybe the rumor is that Green. I, I bet the rumor is just that the Green Goblin killed Norman. Duh, right? <laughs> he clearly died to a to a glider thing. Hey, I have not played Hell Divers. Like I've I've heard good things. But I have not, I haven't played it myself. What was with that girl? Who was she? You know, this chapter opening reminds me of something. The Spidey store gets new items every time a new chapter starts. Aha! Next time you have a chance, visit the store and check out what they've got. This should be a safe spot to change. Hi, Keith. I think that's the... Yeah, when, when Green Goblin turned all those guys into CGI skeletons. Would you rather die by being turned into a CGI skeleton or being stabbed in the crotch by the glider? Which one's the worst death? I feel like the glider stab's gotta be worse. DGI skeleton death has gotta be- it's instant. There's no pain. And it's kinda funny. <laughs> Don't we all want to be a CGI skeleton on this blessed day?
It's going good, Ramiro. I have enough trouble without someone trying to convince oh, Doug that I don't have. Hi, Pete. Yeah, Quasley, the the black cat following bar does not take height into account. You can use the moon jump uh, AR code and just like fly miles in the air and you won't lose Black Cat as long as you're horizontally lined up with her. Which I assume means the rubber banding follows the same trait. Camera was not helping me out there. <laughs> I feel like usually I can deal with the camera not being cooperative when I go to get that token, but that time it was extra weird. I, I actually didn't know that for sure until fairly recently, Quasley, so... I kind of assumed that was the case. But wasn't, you know, I, if you had asked me, I wouldn't have been 100% sure. And I'm still not 100% sure about the rubber banding height thing. It wouldn't surprise me that much if the rubber banding just randomly took height into account. I can't believe I actually got to meet Dr. Otto Octavius. Big swing. Oh, the Commodore Spider-Man game where his health turns into a skeleton. Honestly, every game should have that health bar. That shit's awesome. I think like low res slash low poly skeletons are just like inherently funny. Hey kid, how you making out? Listen, I got a new job for you to do, okay? I don't know why. Also, like whatever the CGI skeletons are in Toby One are also amazing. Dude, how was that not close enough? I almost went into denial because I was I just like couldn't believe I didn't get it. Aren't we all skeletons deep down? I've never seen evidence that that's true for me. Maybe you all have skeletons in there, but I I just I, I don't know. Can't be true. There's no way there's a skeleton in there. Where would it go? There's no room. If anything, if there was a skeleton, I imagine it probably left a long time ago. That token uppercut is just muscle memory that means nothing that I've just built into myself. 
I, it's like hard for me not, not to do it now. I'm just all like paper mache in there. If you give me a good punch, I just like crumple. <laughs> Yeah, the, the token uppercut is funny because a, a few people have... I remember, I think somebody asked at some point, like, like what does the, what is that for? And I was like, <laughs> I was like, well, actually nothing. It doesn't do anything. It's just fun. And because I'm an APM addicted monster who can't not... Who can't just, like, not be doing anything at any given moment. That's really what it's for. It's just to just keep my, my fingers distracted for two seconds while nothing happens. I kind of like that route, actually. That felt pretty fast. Maybe a little bit of an attitude, though. This should be a safe spot to change. I do have a swinging a guide. You can find it just on the channel. There might also be a nightbot command to, to summon it, but I don't remember what it is. So Quentin Beck's gonna I actually don't think that that's huh? true. So this yeah, it's just on the channel. It's called How to Swing Fast, if I remember Ready, correctly. Spider-Man, let's begin. I also have a speedrun route guide, if you're ever looking for that. That is not part of it, what I just did. You can just pretend that that didn't happen, right? Do you like my gadgets, Spider-Man? I perfected the technology on the movie, so we're Oh, I did not just do that. What? That one's just... I don't know. <laughs> that, that one's just unfortunate. Oh, easy on me, Spidey. These guys are not cooperating right now. Okay, that was kind of nice, though. I'm better than you, Spider-Man. Today, I'm going to prove it. Your parents never That's why I have, like, no points. So, I should probably fix that. This is a low-point game regardless. We're on round three, he has three points. Okay, if I go fast, I win this. What are you doing all the way over here, dude? This is the Beck screen stream. I feel like Beck's been trolling today. Come out, come out wherever you are. Oh, there's a midget. Why don't you just give up, Spider-Man? Disappoint all. Gotcha! To be fair, hurling the prisoner into the pit is gotta be a lot less painful than just hurling them around into the concrete because the pits are like padded. That's like throwing them in a bounce house versus onto the concrete. They love it. <laughs> like the, this is Mysterio defending it at a press conference. The prisoners love it. They can't get enough. Those aren't screams of pain. They're screams of joy.
<laughs> it's not just that. The press conference is also... To be fair, he does hold a press conference with real people in the story. He just also kills a lot of them. And nearly kills the rest. I presume some, a lot of them died, because, I mean, looking at it... Do you think the prisoners are going to gain or lose respect? In prison? I feel like you lose respect. You should gain respect, I feel like you lose respect, right? Because it's like kind of goofy. I thought you were asking at first if Quentin Beck gains or loses respect, and I'm like, it's it's not looking good for Quentin Beck in prison, to be honest. There's no way that's netting him points in there. What? Not now. Huh. Why tonight, guys? Looks like interference showed up. It's like you have something against me. This guy has a mind of his own. <laughs> Spider-Man cannot decide who he wants to attack. Okay. Look out! Great. Just take off, guys. I'm not late or anything. Get a shot. Least homie sniper. Stopping? I felt the disrespect on that I one for some reason. I'm putting a stop to Spider Man, thing, please. <laughs> He's a bad man. He he's just attacking anybody. Maybe so. Only saved like six people from the theater. That's that's what I'm saying. Like. How far is this place? Why would those theater reporters choose to sit in the back like that if the front weren't absolutely stuffed with like 400 reporters who are all dead? Think about that. I bet like 500 people died in that theater. I was just going easy on you before. Do you think Chad versus Chad filled out the theaters, though? Or was it like, okay, Mysterio, like, fucking burnt the theater to the ground. We can't, we can't host anything here anymore. And Chad versus Chad got canceled. Are there multiple theaters in Manhattan? There are, right? I guess that's probably not the only theater. I swear, the combat this run has been so weird. Like, my combos... Like that! <laughs> My combos keep dropping to weird shit. And I mean, most of it's technically my fault, but it's just like shit that I've like never seen before in the weirdest way. Like I'm used to the gravity being weird there, but the specific way that it was there and the way that it was making my combos drop was strange. This run's actually not as bad as it looks, though. This run's okay. Hi, Pete. 
Just remember the early game is really bad with these splits. It's really hard, I should say. Not bad. It's actually quite good. Yeah, if you're scared of the color red, that's fair. But I need you to stay, stay strong. Actually reacted to it going at me. <laughs> that was also weird. Every fight has had like something very subtle happen that I've never seen before. Oh, you know I clutched that. All those robots went. This guy's like three miles in the air. I need not soil my hands with a pathetic earthling like you. And this guy's hiding behind stage as usual. Theater is great, but sometimes that happens. Sometimes you get hit with the with the what just happened. What what are these robots doing? It's still my favorite part of the run though. Probably. Even as we speak, my armada is advancing on your city. Our first target will be your Statue of Liberty. Don't get hit by the train. It happens. <laughs> we'll see. It can happen. I'd say... The odds of it happening in a run are... I mean, it depends. It's, you know, it's not like RNG or anything. It's just if I fuck up. But... I like 1 in 10. I don't know. Yeah, that should make it. I was... I didn't think I was getting another swing, and I was like, I might not make it. Finally, good orbs. Yeah, it's surprisingly easy to uh, to overshoot Doc Ock when you're going for like a slow mo hit on him and just eat yourself onto the train tracks. I do think Doc Ock train fight might be the next thing to have a new strat. That might be another thing that I'll be practicing for soon. I have a wow. conceptualization that will probably make like it like a, a few times harder to be honest, but let's save a few seconds. And potentially make zero cycle more consistent. Alright, goodbye. I've been flipped off before, but never quite like that. What's going on? Feels so strange. Ah. Everything is upside down. For, make me go all the way over there for one hit. Oh my! These guys just don't know how to stay in one place. Better up. Great. 
At least I got a triple at the end. Yeah, the game doesn't stop you from leaving orbs. I mean, I guess what are you going to do, right? It's not like anything bad's going to happen. Oh, I didn't know the game would lag. Maybe it does on, like, GameCube or something. That wouldn't surprise me. Looks like I found the exit. Finally. I'm finally out of that crazy place. If I never see another carnival as long as I live, it'll be too soon. I lose time with the jam. Ch chapter 9 is hard now. And I think chapter 10, chapter 10 through 13 is where majority of the time to save is, especially in like chapter 11. So this run is still actually like, okay. So I don't think it's possible to get back into Beck's apartment. Even if you could somehow clip in, there's no way it's loaded in. You probably could get back to um, the the like technically underground section with the Funhouse of Doom with an AR code, but even then, I'm not sure about that. Swing, please! I beg you. It's so easy to get stuck in no man's land there. I have to hurry. The containment field looks like it's buckling. Damn, I got that spacing. <laughs> I just have to smash these power terminals until the reactor shuts down. Almost got it. Only one terminal just, left. That was intentional. I'm I, I'm just playing that close to save like two frames for no reason. Well, the city didn't get I like should not be doing that. <laughs> That's not a smart idea. Uh, I can't believe I'm late to see Dr. It looks really cool though, so maybe I will continue to do it. Thanks for the congrats, Richard. Appreciate it. Oh, this guy. Think about a career change. <laughs> okay, that was maybe... Sometimes you get a delayed explosion sound there. That was like... That was not close. <laughs> that was like the Foley guy in the back of the theater was like... Like super missed his cue to play the explosion sound. I need to figure out what happened to him, but I don't have any leads. I should drop by the Daily Bugle. It's like, oh shit, well, I'll play it anyways. Maybe they won't notice. The Vine Boom sound effect wishes it could be that cool. I had movement in mind that I thought would be cool, but slow, and I didn't get to do it. Hi, Betty. Hi, Betty. Dr. Octavius is a killer. Is it my fault? I don't know if I... I think I'm losing a couple seconds, yeah, probably. It's so hard to tell with Chapter 10. Where's my swing? I got robbed of a swing there. I was falling for so long. <laughs> Can things get any worse? Don't wait, well, 
I withdraw the question. Yeah, so Fox got the right idea. You gotta it's it's only respectful to say hi to Betty. You'll get this. your rent when you fix this damn yeah. door! <laughs> Thank you for the super chat, Subsmug. Hi, Betty. So true. Appreciate it. Oh, I did I get the hard one? It's been a while since I've hit that one. That's the like super hard quick kill. You just gotta you gotta take the hit and then hit him back. Yo, thanks for the sub. Didn't quite catch the name, but I appreciate it. I just saw it out of the corner of my eye. Sorry, I'm trying to do two token. I'm gaming right now. Well, maybe. We'll see. I knew I didn't need slow-mo. Trust your gut. Believe in yourself. That was really close, though. Read about is it me, or is the train for, like, one frame when you load in there, the train's there? Like, on the ground. Am I hallucinating that? I, I swear I saw that just now. Yo, real dogs. Octavius blames me for Rosie's death. Okay, that oh yes, that I was okay, that was alive. secretly really cool. Um probably not very fast, but very cool. I, I, I'm right about that time save in Chapter 11. But do I consider it too late to reset a run? Uh, it depends. It's really... It's kind of vibes, as much as that doesn't mean anything. Um, it really is just like... Like, right now, I don't have any plans to reset it, but like... If I fail Shocker Skip, I will. So I guess I would say like... Once you hit, like, chapter 14 is around the point where I'm like, that's, you know, once you're past Shocker Skip 2 and there's no, like, big thing that's gonna take a long time to push through if you fuck it up, is probably around the point where I would generally say it's not worth it to reset because you want that late game experience. No, I actually didn't want that. Oh, wait, that wall... I didn't want that wall jump, but it was actually such a sick setup for that web zip. <laughs> Never mind. So, how did you I, I shouldn't have doubted you, wall jump. I didn't think the angle would just be perfect for that. Seriously? I knew I should have kept a better eye on that guy. As for, like, how no, long you should the let the, you know, be behind before you reset, that also depends on splits. These days, if I'm going for, like, low reset... Low reset in my mind means if I if it's past plus thirty, then I'll reset. Otherwise, it just depends on how I'm feeling about the run. What I'm trying to accomplish. I would say resetting a speed run is is an art, more than a science. How far is this place? I haven't really kept up with Pokemon lately. Ever since National Dex died, I was kind of out. I didn't even know you could do AR codes on PS Simulator at all. On Dolphin, it's super easy. Which you can even do. You can even mix and match with 
gecko codes, which is awesome. Which gecko codes kind of just seem like better AR codes in like every way, from what I can tell. It's just AR codes, but you could do more with them. Maybe that's not correct. All right, since since I've been doing new strats today, here, here's another new strat for you. Instead of going around town, be careful there, but with that, it's way easier to beat her to the last point. So that's arguably faster than, the, than getting the second disco. But it, I did almost fail the race because I went too far ahead with her, so it might require pacing. But I don't think I've ever done that strat in a run. I thought I fucked up there. To be honest, if you had showed me the frame before I went past over, I would say that shocker skip doesn't work. Okay, that's, that's three, I guess. Still slow and dumb, I see. Careful, cat. You'll hurt his feelings. Oh, I... That was kind of a snipe, I'm not gonna lie. I have tried PC SX2. That's probably the first time I've said it correctly on stream. I think it's alright. I think it's definitely improved over the years. Last time I used it, it had input lag. I noticed input lag, though. Not that I don't notice input lag on other- Oh my god, the swinging. Don't look. Okay, you can look again. But like, wow. I just couldn't- couldn't get that back on track. I wonder what Shocker is planning. What I want to see improve, I want a good Xbox emulator uh, version of this game. Wow, that roll yeeted me into the room. Because <laughs> if, if we can get like a super accurate good Xbox emulation of this game, then that'd be so nice. Xemu is not quite there, unfortunately. That one's also improved though. Like the fact that you can play that is kind of wild. Alien invaders holding up a convenience. Obviously, top of the list is a good decomp, but you know that's asking a lot. Great. Now to get these photos to the bugle. I swear this movement is secret. It, this movement is. I think this movement might be the hardest bit of movement in the whole run. It's so hard to get smooth movement there. Deposing Betty. I can't believe that. Jameson would frame his own mother if he thought it would sell papers. What did I ever do to Jameson? What could he possibly have? Let's we'll see if bu buildings are... It's just a double-edged sword, right? We need the buildings to swing fast off of. But, we don't want to swing into the buildings. It's like yin and yang. Fast swings can't exist without bonks. Bonks can't exist without fast swings. One needs the other. A balance must be struck. the roof exists <laughs> I tried to listen I tried to talk to the New York City uh, architect you know the main designer they wouldn't have it they were not interested in hearing me talk about this wallless city structure that I had in mind for fast swinging 
They said it wasn't worth it to, <laughs> to, to basically make the entirety of New York City uh, homeless and financially unviable just so that I could swing faster. I don't really know what they were on about, though. Still about as subtle as a train wreck, aren't you? This guy gave you trouble, Spider? Yeah, well, I was young. Shocker is still a boring name. I still don't know why Shocker just sometimes decides not to be comboed. About time, you losers got... Or it's not even Shocker that do it. Spider-Man is just like, nah, I don't really feel like doing the rest of the combo. I just, I'm just gonna do a spinning kick and then nothing. How about that? If only all my problems could be settled with flashy climactic battles. It would make NYC very depressing. It'd be depressing because nobody would live there. <laughs> nobody would go there. Uh, I don't know what happens when I load in here. I think I don't touch the water. I'd give it a 80% chance that I'm fine. Nope. Mary Jane's <laughs> Maybe I can make it well, at least the split was green. And it was funny. On a run like this, I'm down to lose time for, for the lulls. Yeah, we're doing scuba skip a little early this time. My bad. Going for it. I'm getting good at hitting that. That's not easy. Spider-Man. Spider-Man, please. Spider-Man, please hit him, please. He can't decide today. He doesn't, he's not interested. Spider-Man hits who he wants. He's not interested in my input anymore. Why can't I just tell MJ the truth? I can't believe she's getting married. I also missed the health. The ah, I was supposed to meet Kat this so, evening. That's fine. I guess I should go. That one time I died by splatting there. But now you know the stakes, right? That was to set up the stakes. Now whenever I go for it and I get it, it's really cool. Because you know that I'm, I might die yeah. if I go for it. And I'm like risking the run for to save like two frames. Maybe not two frames. Like half a second. You used to be fast, Cat. What happened? Yeah, maybe I- maybe- you ever think that maybe I failed there on purpose? For the hype? How did I get so much height there? I got shot too. I might die. I'm gonna die. <laughs> okay. I take it back. Well, hang on. No, let's finish this run. Let's finish it. Why not? I am going to need to... F Wait, hang on. Maybe I can't. Can I? I'm gonna be low on hero points. Because I'm gonna lose 500 hero points. But the I'll gain hero points from getting these kills, so maybe it'll make it up? I don't think you have an oxygen permit. I don't know what it, what it is with my combat today, but like... I swear, it is so hard to get Spider-Man to focus. On one guy. If any other enemy gets in the same area code, he just, he's, he's going right for him. I almost died again. I took so much damage in that fight. 
You think you need to f get the backup tokens? Is Cat right? I want to find out. I I'm kind of curious. I, what about the people in my life? How would they feel? It isn't like anyone. Well, they grabbed that health. I mean, that's fine. This run wasn't PBing, anyways. We're kind of learning, anyways. This is just practice at this point. No matter how hard it is, I can't abandon my friend. So, what? Do I quit being. No, I can't quit either. I help so many people. I can't give up being Peter Parker. But I can't give up. So I got a bunch. I got really far into that fight before I died. Here's my argument. Maybe I can balance the I'm losing 500 euro points because I technically cat. lost a black cat for some reason. But I killed a bunch of extra guys. So maybe I'm actually doing fine on hero points. Maybe it isn't too late. Maybe I can be Spider-Man and still be with him. Five jumps in the water. That's true. It does depend on when you start, though. I usually start on like the the second line, but if you start on the first, I guess you would need an extra jump. Totally crazy. Things could never work out. What about the danger? I must have been out of my mind to ask her. I think I don't have enough. I should just keep away from her. At least she still has Well, I know where one backup is that I could try. I <laughs> do that in wave machines at water parks. You're trading for scuba skip yeah. early. Harry's been a much better friend than I'll ever be. I'm no good for MJ anyway. I think it's right here. She's better off with it's like good to know. Or maybe it's not. Is it back here? Yeah, it is. Is this enough? I need five more hero points. Okay, get this and then get that. Perfect. Perfect speedrun strat. I'm only continuing with this because I really want the I want the practice for chapter 15. I think it's worth it. I need to apologize to MJ next time I see her. I don't think I should buy health, because this is just practice at this point, but there might come a time when I need to I need to clutch a run of low health. I need to be ready for that. Oh. Is chapter 3 the most cathartic to gold? Depends on the context. I feel like it's if you PB with a chapter 15 gold, that's like the sickest thing of all time. Otherwise, it's probably chapter 3 just because it's probably the hardest. Chapter 14 also feels really good to gold because I don't know why, but chapter 14, no matter what, it seems to always be really hard for me to save time in at all. It feels like the trend is on my on every run except for the PB, I lose time on chapter 14. And then on the PB, I like even it out. So it just remains really hard. MJ sounds like she's about to evict Peter. That's impressive because they don't live together. I what? Well, I I promise I dodged. Okay, that was actually fine.
Yeah, gold just means that's my fastest time for any particular split. It's called gold because the timer color turns gold. Where's my glide? I'm stuck in no man's land. That is actually the worst glide in the game to miss. I'm very firm on that opinion. And it's also a really hard one. And that glide is super cool, <laughs> so it evens it out. Jesus, Landlord. <laughs> I mean, Mr. Dikovic isn't in this game, so maybe. Oh, did you see what I, I was? I just did it while moving. That was that was weird. Have I ever done that? How did I do that? <laughs> I kind of want to look that over. Yeah, if, if that if if I can find a consistent way to do that, do I die to this? No, I'm fine. If I can find a consistent way to do that, that like legit does save time. That should do. I hit him again. What an I thought he was dead. <laughs> I, w I took my hand off the controller to go split. I did not think that hero punch was whiffing. Can you beat Spider Man 2 the movie game without swinging? Yeah. I've done it several times. Alright, that's it. This for Rosie. That's it. Oh, he's trolling today. Fuck that guy. <laughs> But yeah, if you want to see me do it swingless, there are um, videos on this channel of me doing swingless speedruns. Recommend checking it out. Alright. That run's done. Tell you what, I'm going to use the bathroom real quick. And I'll be right back, and then we'll do some more runs. Sound good? See you in a minute. Welcome to part two. All right, I'm back. We are definitely still going if... Uh-oh, wait. Capture card? Hang on. <laughs> Maybe I spoke too soon. What's going on? You there, buddy? It just left. Uh... I didn't, it's not hidden. 
I've never had it break like this before. My capture card is finding new and innovative ways to not work anymore. What if I deactivate? Activate. Okay, hang on. I'm going to try something. This has worked before. Uh, the stream's going to go down for like 30 seconds. So be right back. Okay. Are we good? I think we're good. I think we're back. Hopefully. Wait. OBS, please. I think we're back. Again, I think we're back for real. Hell yeah. <laughs> the stream did go offline. Um, first my capture card broke and the only way to fix it involves restarting OBS. And then OBS also disconnected on its own, which it has to do. OBS like has a rule when I stream now. It has to disconnect once about two minutes, about like somewhere between 30 seconds and two minutes into the stream. It's like, all right, it's disconnecting time. Um, and normally I get that out of the way because I don't like, I don't go publicly live and I just wait for that to happen. But there was no getting, there was no getting away from it this time. But let's, let's do some more, huh? Next 100% when? I feel like the next 100% is going to be me preparing for and doing the 100% speedrun. I don't know when that'll be exactly, but I think that's what it's going to be. Well, sequel time already, huh? Welcome back, I guess. First things first. I think, um, I think the 100% speedrun is going to be hype. Maybe individual parts of it will be boring and tedious, but that's going to be sick, isn't it? The first 100% speedrun ever. Maybe the first time it's ever been done in one sitting. Probably the first time it's ever been done in one sitting. I got so caught up in what I was doing, I forgot all about it. It's gonna kill me. I believe I'm running And I think so the 100% casual playthrough I did on stream was also a lot of fun. Help me. I feel like that angle was good if I actually got the web ball out in time. I was almost there, too. Didn't your mom tell you not to hit girls? I'm thinking about making that the 5k milestone instead of the 10k milestone. What do y'all think? Is that going back or my word, or secretly cool? Case secure! Briefcase guy's been struggling today. Why does stuff like this always happen when I'm running late? Hi, my name's. Maybe I can still make it before class ends. I don't think it's gonna take 16 hours. If I prepare properly for 100% speedrun, it won't take 16 hours. The white dot on your map here and the white destination marker are both pointing you to the pizza park. You need to get over there at some point, but there's no rush. I think somewhere between 8 and 12 is more accurate. I think it either either way it will be my longest stream ever. This is a good time to talk like regardless. You already know that you use them to buy stuff from the Spidey store, right? Oh, you don't? Well, then you weren't paying attention. Naturally, the only way it would take 16 is if I crash a lot, which I think during the speedrun I'm probably going to save roughly every hour anyways. Some other ways too, so try different things and see what you like. You can only be a good one. So, I don't think I would lose that much even if I did crash. Cake was good. I'm stuck. 
I had competition at 100% when I try hard. Depends on what type of competition, because like, if I need to like grind 100% day and night, I don't against like. Some 100% fanatic who like only runs that and just plays that every day. I might just concede. <laughs> But I could see doing a, a run every once in a while. Can't believe I ran off like that. I must be out of my mind. To keep up with the one hundred percent meta. Now he turned it up enough. Bam! Ugh, that at you. new strat hard. I did not imp- I swear to god I did not input that second swing. Tough job market for our team, huh? Yeah, I had a GDQ run... I wanna say 2022? I did- I was in a- I think I was in AGTQ 2022. I have a shirt <laughs> that says which one it was. <laughs> So you can find that if you search for it. One day I'd like to do another one, but... I don't know when that will be. Sorry, not my style. You asked me in 2015. It was probably later than that, unless... I think I started... When did I start streaming? Like, 2016 or 17? But yeah, like, a, a long time ago. I mean, I wasn't wrong, I guess. Because <laughs> I did end up doing it in 2022, so... Not exactly near future, but that is really cool. Feel free to slow down. I'd be happy to make myself available for your admiration. If I don't close distance with her soon, she's gonna get away. That is a good point though, Big Lion, is... I guess, yeah, I'm gonna have to take restroom breaks in the... 100% run. I feel like I never internalize how often you have to pee, because in my mind... I mean, you don't pay attention to how often you pee, you know what I mean? Like... You be some old lady but yeah, I guess if it's gonna be 8 plus hours, I'm probably gonna have to. That's so, that's free time, though. Who was with that girl? Who was she? Plus, yeah, I'm probably gonna want to have like a drink and stuff. The Spidey store gets new items every time a new chapter starts. Aha! Next time you have a chance. Yo, big lion, welcome to member. Hell yeah. Appreciate it. Enjoy the the emotes and all that. We back. Love to see it. Thank you. Appreciate it. Hi, Pete. I think that's the... I did get, um, a new idea for a video, an edited video the other day. I don't know when or if this will happen, and I'm actually not saying what the, what the idea is. Just, just getting you hyped for content that may or may not happen. <laughs> Which is kind of fucked up now that I think about it. But... Just saying. Because what happens? Oh, there's the there's the alert. What happens is um, I get an idea for a video, and then I sit on it for a while, and then I finally open it in the editor, and I make it in like three days. And that's the only way that I ever get motivation to do videos.
But I guess where I was leading to that was that members get to, you know, get one day early access to, to edited videos and they get to have their names in the back. I think that that's how my brain got there, I don't know. <laughs> but And I, I will also eventually finish the 100% uh, edited videos, because I think those are fun, but I have like, there's like a level of quality that I want them to be at, and the one that I was editing wasn't quite there, so I'm kind of starting over. Which is unfortunate, but it will lead to better video, so probably worth it. The only thing that I can say about the next 100% video is that I spent like two and a half hours uh, for a three second joke in that video. And I'm not joking about that. I spent two and a half hours in gameplay and editing for a joke that lasts like three seconds in the video. Try not to run into Am I proud of it? Place. Kinda. Because I think it's funny. And it was kind of fun. I'm starting to see why rhinos are endangered. Yeah, it's also the type of joke that would not be funny if I didn't, like, put way too much effort into it, you know what I mean? Favorite on-screen superhero? What does on-screen mean in that context? If a superhero is, like, slightly out of frame, do they not count then? Or does that mean superhero that just has a TV show or movie? Regardless, I feel like it's, it's gotta be Spider-Man, right? I don't know what the dragonfly is. You know what? You know what that just unlocked though? Memory unlocked. American Dragon, the TV show. I remember liking that show, and then they like changed the art style, and Kid Me fucking hated that. And probably didn't give it a fair chance, but I'm sure it was fine. I just remember one time watching Toonami at night, and the Toonami guy asked who would win, Naruto or American Dragon? <laughs> and I was like, I was like, I'm sorry, American Dragon. It's over for you. <laughs> I don't really remember much about American Dragon other than that I liked it. I like I don't remember any I don't remember very much of it. It's kinda like um There are a lot of shows like that that I don't like remember other than liking I think Courage the Cowardly Dog is another one. I didn't actually watch that much of it, but I remember liking the episodes that I did, and there were some that scared me too. Uh, uh what else? Jackie Chan Adventures, another show that I probably watched like three episodes ever, but I remember liking. I think it just wasn't on at the right time. Instead, I was stuck watching the same episode of Ben 10 over and over and over and over and over again. Because Cartoon Network would just play the episode where where Gwen gets the watch instead of Ben. And they would play that every single day for like three months. And I never knew why. <laughs> That's when the internet's fattest fascinates with power scaling. I would describe myself, I don't have a fascination with power scaling, but like... Like, if the only time it bothers me is when you have a fight and it's clearly like it's just narrative. Like, this fight happens this way and it's obviously because it's narrative and they haven't thought about power scaling at all and it doesn't make any sense. That just like super brings me out of the world.
Other than that, I'm willing to hand wave it. But if I do notice it, like, nothing else riles me up the same way. Because it's like... If the story doesn't make sense, then why are we telling it? Like, obviously you should be writing a narrative first, but in that case you should probably make the story make sense. Like, narrative's awesome. And, like, I, I don't want to... Like, I don't watch the anything or consume any media for power scaling, but, you know, it's just part of making sense as a continuity, I guess. So, maybe I worded that weirdly to imply that, like, uh -huh. I don't give a shit about narrative. Flattery will get you nowhere with me. How, okay. I don't actually am not sure how I didn't grab that. That was that I had to have been so close to grabbing it. I think a lot of characters are too silly to power scale. It would be better if you slowed. You don't think Patrick uh, no diffs, Mr. Krabs? You're gonna you're gonna look me in the eyes and tell me that? You think Mr. Krabs is doing anything to Patrick? <laughs> Those big meaty claws ain't doing shit. Actually, just gonna bonk him with a coconut. It's over. Black cat seems okay. Maybe a little bit of an attitude, though. I don't see anyone around. This reminds me of when you go to like the like those power scaling wikis and you like here here's a challenge. Go to power scaling wikis and look up like some innocent character. That's like a cartoon character, and they're gonna scale. There's like a fifty percent chance they're gonna list them as like. A world buster. I remember I, I looked up like a Mario page one time and like apparently Mario has, can like fucking destroy a planet and shit. Because of like something he does in like a couple of his games. I don't know. Ready, Spider Man? Let's begin. Ever Marvel and DC PS2 Xbox games that I played? To be honest, I think just Toby won. I'm not like I don't play like a ton of other superhero like games all the time. The on the movies, not that I have anything against them. But I'm not as cultured as I could be on that front. A million SpongeBob kicks Goku's ass. There's no way. Which Goku? <laughs> what? What's the weakest? What's the strongest Goku that loses to a million SpongeBob's? Maybe power scaling is fun. I changed my mind. This shit's awesome. That that's what an amazing question to to be able to ask and like think about. Kind of reminds me of when I, I was like, I think, I don't remember if I was inebriated. <laughs> I think I might have had just got done drinking with some friends and I watched a video about how Bobo Bo is like the most powerful character in the entire, all of fiction. And I believed it. Like after watching that video, I was like, yeah, I agree. <laughs> Because he's a he's a gag character, so he, whatever happens to him is just gonna be the funniest thing that happens, and it's way funnier that if he the stronger the opponent that he beats. Bobo Bo versus a million tiny Spongebobs. We've gone too far. <laughs> this conversation has become incomprehensible to anybody who wasn't paying attention. You need to have watched like three movies.
I legitimately think Bobo Bo, Bo can do whatever he wants. He just... It just has to be funny. Do I reset that? That's not great. Reset that? What do you think? Reset that and do one more? One more good one? I like that idea. One more good one. Because otherwise that would end up being the last run. My heart's telling me to do this. Here's the thing, I do know diff all of all of fiction because I just turned the TV well, off, dumbass. Already, huh? Welcome back, I guess. <laughs> first things first. If it's a book, I stop reading, and then you don't exist anymore outside of my conscious. Uh, before we go any further, I think it might be a good idea to save your progress, if you could call it that. Just go to the pause menu and bring up the save load screen. It's easy, right? Then do it. Oh, no. I do like Dragon Ball. I got so and I, in what I was doing. I'm sad that the creator is no longer with us. So late. Still, I should be able to make it as long as. Help me! Because he wasn't like that old or anything. I was almost there too. Hey, I don't think he was. Because my take is, you know, sometimes you hear about uh, celebrities, you know, they die and it's like they were like 80 plus. And it's like, yeah, it's still sad that they're gone, but like, I, I'd, I'd be pretty happy to make it to eighty. You know what I mean? <laughs> like, you know, at a certain point, it was a pretty good life. But if I, if I, if I died now, I'd be a little sad because I'm, I think this might be well, I'm a little young. Check your to -do list. It'll show you the white dot on your map here and the white destination marker. That's my goal. I want to live long enough that when I die, people are like instead of. Instead of it being like a huge tragedy, they're like, ah, well, they had a good run. <laughs> they had a good run. Bobo Bo versus Goku. After watching that video, I'm telling you, Go uh, Bobo Bo wins, and it's not close. This is a good time to talk a little about hero. You already know that you're using to buy stuff from the Spidey store, right? Oh, you don't? Well, then you weren't paying attention. Naturally, Toriyama was 68. Yeah, that's getting... You got plenty of 68's, like, alright, but, you know, obviously, it's still sad. Would have liked to have him around for a little longer. Dinner, I promised MJ I would meet her this evening. I gotta hurry. I can't believe I ran off like that. I must be out of my mind. Dodd tier list? Do I want to know what that is? I knew we'd show up. Spider-Man was butt in. Was that anything like the building tier list? Yeah, that's one thing that can happen there. Date of death. Ah, I see. I don't think I've ever heard that abbreviation. Sometimes when you're streaming, nothing scarier than when you get hit with an abbreviation you've never heard of before. You're like, what is that? <laughs> you're like, it's probably nothing bad, but like, what if it is? 
Like, I have to be very measured sometimes. Not that it bothers me though, I'm not I'm not complaining. I'm just making a joke. Yeah, also <laughs> the fact that, you know, if it's from somebody that I you know, has repeatedly not been on bad behavior in chat then then it's all different thing. myself available for your admiration. If I don't close distance with her soon, she's going to get away. We'll never see the paper that says you're dead. I mean, maybe you will. Maybe it'll just be lying. Or maybe you'll get back up. <laughs> just you wait. I die tomorrow. They write my, my death certificate. You don't know when to quit, do you? And then... Somebody at the funeral is like, did you hear somebody beat Sly's PB? And I, the, the casket lid flies off, <laughs> flies out, <laughs> and the singular arm raises. I'm coming back. Who was with that girl? Who was she? You know, this chapter opening reminds me of something. The Spidey store gets new items every Nate ain't here to give hidden and obscure knowledge of this game. All right, Nate, now's your chance. Say something true about this game. <laughs> no one's around. I Getting teleported. Yep. So fucked up when he talk He starts talking there and it's just like, well, there's nothing that can be done. I think that's the... Th they buried me with my controller. If I... They better give me an official wired one. Which I, is funny, because I don't use an official wired one, but... Spare no expense for my funeral. I don't care if you have to buy it at a hundred... Like, two hundred dollars. I went everywhere but where the token was there. Did you see that? I made like a parabola around it. What's up with this Beck guy? How can he possibly claim Why does that teleport happen? It's actually the same bug that causes bathroom spawn. Uh or a similar bug rather. And we don't really know why, but basically I I think the game's programming if I had to summarize, probably doesn't uh, account for the fact that sometimes Spider-Man will say a line about changing for certain cutscenes, so if that line does happen, then shit gets fucked up. And it causes you to be warped back to uh, the spawn point in the bathroom. Oh, is Which is good when it happens in chapter 7 and 13, and bad when it happens in chapter 4 and 9. Although 9 is very easy to get around if you know what to, what to look for. <laughs> My funeral's being held at Chuck E. Cheese? That's kinda cool. I can't tell if that, like, I really don't want that or I kind of want that. You know what I mean? Like, on one hand, that's kind of bad at. So on the other hand, I don't want to be remembered at a Chuck E. Cheese. That where you are by using your head, I see. Can we have, like, two funerals? Like, we have, like, a first funeral that's funny at the Chuck E. Cheese and then a solemn one afterwards at a cool gothic graveyard where it's where lightning strikes when they lower the casket into the ground. Funeral silly. I mean, yeah. 
I see I see the merit in that, you know, just having a good time. It's supposed to be a positive remembrance, you know. I don't want people to be, you know, like, think about me and cry <laughs> too much. They, they, they can cry a little bit. Is Chuck E. Cheese still a thing? I think so. Maybe they only do funerals now. <laughs> I can't believe I actually got to meet Dr. Otto Octavius. It'll have to be on the railroad tracks. That'd be fucked up, because, you know, I've... I've, I've <laughs> okay, I'm not going to say that. <laughs> I was going to say something, and then I realized that it could be taken a certain way, so I'm not going to say it anymore. But I had a very funny... I had a very funny, questionable joke lined up there. If you follow the conversation, you can probably figure out what I was going to say. They do water cremation? Yo, you could turn into Muck from Pokemon? That sounds cool. I'm down. They just take whatever useful organs I got on me, because I'm an organ donor. And then the rest of me turns to muck. That sounds sick. But in like 70 years. Eh, 60. I don't need 70 more. Listen, I got a new job for you to do, okay? There's these things called photo op tokens that I want you to find. I've marked them on your map just to spell it out really Just thinking, for you. think about what other cool types of mation they've got in, in 60 years, though. You could they could probably turn you into like a lightsaber that works and like actually slices through shit by then. That's probably the only way to do it is with with like dead people. Can't you be turned into diamonds now? I mean, diamonds are mostly carbon, which is like what we're made out of, right? Are you saying you can about the lightsaber thing? Because if so, that's that's neat. And I, I I should specify. I don't mean, like, I want my ashes to be put in a lightsaber with a light in it. I mean, I want to be the energy that fuels... I want to be, like, the Kyber crystal or whatever it's called. The Kyber from Yu-Gi-Oh! crystal. That's me. <laughs> I'm flattered. Well, I wouldn't keep chasing you if you didn't keep breaking into places. And then Ewan McGregor and Samuel Jackson, who are still alive for some reason 60 years from now, can use me to cut down bad guys. What color lightsaber? I'm definitely purple, cause you know I'm like I'm like I'm like a good person, but I'm like I'm like a kind of little <laughs> I'm like a little. There's a little bit of darkness in there. Also, purple is my favorite color, if you couldn't tell. Sorry, I'm not measuring up to your expectations. She's pretty fast. I need to concentrate if I want to keep up with her. Ooh, perfect amount of height. Okay. I'm getting better at that. One of those Bud BuzzFeed lightsaber tests. Isn't BuzzFeed, like, dead? 
Black Cat seems okay. Maybe a little bit of an attitude, though. All Do you expose me to the Sin Eater? Is that how it happens? Is it... I don't know if I want to expo be exposed to the Sin Eater. So Quentin Beck's gonna prove I'm a fake, huh? This, I gotta say. Ready, Spider-Man? Let's begin. Do you like my gadgets, Spider-Man? I perfected the technology on the movie Sorority Death Robots. I don't know about your effects, but your education must have been special. Uh, there's not a particular time I want to hit Flurkin. It's more just um a certain run I want to get. If I had if I had to say a time I was aiming for, it'd be nice to get sub uh 5230, but if I get like a run that's a few seconds better than that, and I'm happy with it, you, then I'm then I'm happy with it. You know what I mean? Oh fuck, he's still here. I thought I thought he went in for sure. I also thought that was the last round, to be honest. Because normally you don't get scores this high without that being the last round. I think I still win though. Yeah, I, I, I like almost definitely win. What separates Toby 2 from other speed games, in my opinion, it's uh, the fact that the movement is different every time, but it's still all skill. I think that's very unique. And what it can do to grow, I mean, I'm doing my best, I don't know. I feel like I've done what I can. You know, I've put out, there's guides, there's resources to help people, you know, I'm streaming and trying to... Even the audience is and getting better. Beck is the real phony here. So, I think it'll grow when more people run it, I guess. Last I'll hear from Beck. To be honest, better access to the hardware to run it <laughs> would be the, the best, but I don't know if there's much we can do about that. Yeah, at a certain point, people just kind of have to play the game, you know? It's also not the, the end of the world to have a, a nice, comfy, small community, you know what I mean? That's why I'm saying if the PC decomp happens and is like good, we we legit run on that as the main as the main game. Because anybody can get that, you know what I mean? Or obviously if a, if an actual PC port happens, <laughs> that's good. But to be honest, I have I have more faith in one of them and <laughs> less faith in the other. There is no decomp in the works. I just think it would be neat, and if I had more time, I would work on it myself. Still might eventually try to do it myself, but I really can't commit to that. Dr. Octavius' theories are amazing. My head is still spinning from talking to him. Oh no. Mary Jane's play. If I hurry, I can still make it in time. For most people, it's more about the runner. I can feel that. 
I feel like uh, that's just kind of how streaming works in my mind, is, you know, you kind of show up for the game and stay for the streamer, ideally. I mean, obviously, you know, if that's not how it is for you, then that's all, that's all good with me, but that's at least how it works for me. But yeah, that makes sense to me. I do think competition's also good. And I mean, I'm not late or anything. Trying to think of I'm legitimate. <laughs> trying to think of a way of saying this without sounding like stuck up. People are catching up, you know what I mean? I don't think there's a way to say that without like tooting my own horn. But people are getting better. Phase and Nate are both both have have like legitimately really good times. Although Nate's is an emulator, but still a really good time. And if Joey ever comes back, I'm sure he'll be really good too. And then people like Noob Slayer and a couple other names that I wish I I feel bad for not remembering are also kind of getting better in the background. How far is this place? Not too far. Just stay with me. So it's not like nobody else is running. How fast does Spider-Man go in the speedrun? Um, I know you don't hit the cap or anything in the speedrun. And generally, really, the fastest movement doesn't either, because the way to hit the movement cap is generally by swinging at the very end of, at, like, right at the end of a long fall. So, I could check after this run if I remember. I'm sure it's nothing, like, too wild. It's more about maintaining a good speed. And also, you know, speedrun only gets up to swing speed six. But I think the max speed is like two, it's like 300. 300 miles per hour. Or something like that, whatever unit it uses. I knew that was happening. I just had to watch that happen. I guess I could have dodged, but then, you know, either the result is the same, that combo is not finishing. Please hit him. Yo, sick running swing. It's a combo of both. Oh, the the stay for come for the game, stay for the streamer. Yeah, there, there's a measure of that as well. It's a little both for sure. For it just depends on the ratio for everybody, I guess. Okay, guess I'd better get going. That news conference is gonna start any minute. Where's my swing? How am I supposed to go to the store without my swing? What's that bonk? Holy shit. That is an impressively bad bonk. I don't even know, like, how that happened. So, if you don't know, those signs only have collision at the very base of them. So it's impressive that I hit it at all. But I, it turned me around somehow like that. Oh shit, wait. Wait. No. If I can get them up to that balcony, they should be able to escape. Okay, back on track. Oh, 
I will say, I'm kind of shocked this area doesn't ever lag. Like, there's a lot happening. Maybe it lags on GameCube? I don't know. But there's, like, fire, there's moving textures, there's transparency, there's smoke particles, there's a lot of... There's en en a lot of NPCs and enemies in the, in the area. And it just runs stably. In my opinion, that's... This is like a really impressive area area for the for the time this game came out. In the consoles that it came out on. If you do not hurry, your fellow humans will be destroyed while you waste time. A futile gesture, spider human. Like even now a lot of I I read a post recently talking about how even like modern AAA games avoid transparency in 3D models. Because it's just a very intensive thing. If he's attacking Lady Liberty, I'd better get over there in a hurry. Swing. Okay, that's not really what I meant, but I guess I'll give it a shot. Okay, wait. It's been a while. I know you all missed it. Boat strats are back. Just for now. I have to admit, Mysterio knows how to make it seem. Better figure out some way to get Lady Liberty. Maybe none of you missed it. Maybe that was just me. <laughs> yeah, I think it's when there's multiple transparencies like overlapping that it's it, I guess it just gets like exponentially harder to calculate. Yeah, I feel like it was, like, years ago I used to go for both strats intentionally. Now I guess it's just a, it's regulated to a backup. I love, I also love calling it boat strats when it's literally just swing off the boat is the strat. The strategy is I'm gonna swing off the boat. <laughs> swings today. Wasn't there one PB where I swung off the boat in chapter 13? I feel like that happened. Wow. Mysterio's hidden Or was, was that the buoy one? Like an apartment. Knowing, um, <laughs> there's some weird strat names out there. Do we have any weird strat okay. names I've been off before, but never that just, like, don't make sense? Going on? So I'm trying to think. I feel like most of the strat names, like, even Scuba Skip, which is a funny name, like, it makes sense in the context of it. You're like, oh, okay, you jump in the water like a scuba diver. There's no just like, nothing just like completely nonsensical. Looks like I found the exit, finally. Okay, yeah, gamer jump does not explain what it is. That's true. Finally out of that That's just place. that kind of is a slightly different category for me. It's definitely close. But in my mind, that's like um, like there's a piece of tech called Terran pause, which is just where you pause the game to. Uh, oh, sorry, I almost fell out of my chair. Where you pause the game to 
um, basically uncharge your jump for free without having to actually jump. Um, and that's just named after a person. I'd say Gamer Jump falls in that category too, but it does just out of context make no fucking sense. Like, what? It, what is? what does that mean? And also, I, doesn't Nate not have the gamer? Because Nate's full tag used to be Nate, Nate the Man two two three gamer, but now I, I think it's just Nate the Man two two three now, right? So, so that makes even less sense. Jumping like a gamer. I feel like the average gamer probably does not jump very well. I don't think, like, I'm not... You know what, I think I'm alright at jumping, but... <laughs> I'm certainly not, like, extraordinary. Oh, whoops. You should have called it, like, athlete jump, because you jump like an athlete. Hurry. The containment field looks like it's buckling. I don't have time for subtlety. Just have to smash these power terminals okay, I flew too close to the sun. I accept it. I got a little too cocky with the horse field. I've been testing my limits the past few runs. Boat strats, car boost, pseudo web zips. All those make sense to me. I haven't read all. I can't read that all at once. I need to swing at some point. I find that I can swing while reading at chat for like a second at a time now. I have to like, I look and then I'm like, okay, back to, cause I can swing in peripheral vision for like a second, but then I need to go back. Is it still Magnum Drop or Mag Maggie Drop? That's up to you. Dr. Connors, I'm sorry. I think Dr. you get to decide. Connors, if if a strat's named after you, right and you it's change your name, happened. that's up to you. I should drop by the Daily Bugle. Maybe I can pick up a lead there, or at least earn enough to pay my life bill. However, if you came up with a strat and named it something not to do with your name, I think you're stuck with it. I think that's fair. Like if I named slide, if I changed my name to something not sly related, and I wanted to change slide jump to something else, I think that's fair. But if I had named the slide jump goober jump, then it's stuck like that. Where was the entrance supposed to be? You can see where the entrance to the first sewer is. Actually, you can see where both the entrances are. They're just like, there's a couple sewer grates that have 3D models instead of textures, and those are the ones that are supposed to be the entrances. But hypothetically, if the sewers weren't cut, I think the idea was um, that they would, uh, right? They would, they would be like, you could go to any sewer grate and just jump in the sewer. Can things get any worse? No, wait, well, Roughly. Or maybe there was only a select few, but yeah, I think that was the concept, right? Was most of this, you know, any sewer grate, you could just hop in. And there would just be the sewer underneath the map. They really came up with uh, putting a map under the map uh, 18 years or wh however many before Elden Ring. Right there, Doctor. Your suffering has Holy shit, did you see that spacing? What an That's actually that was I've never done that before. Not one for which I am wholly Alright, So he went for the side swipe and I just I just ran to the right, dodged it and fucking beat the shit out of him. What what are you doing back here, dude? I've, I, yeah, I've definitely never done that. Normally what you do there is you take the hit, but I would, 
I don't know, I just saw that he was only swinging from one direction, and I was like, well, I'm just gonna go over here then. Oh, I got stuck on the lady. That's one of the fucked up things about Two Token, is NPC spacing can legitimately make it like three times harder. I can't believe I didn't fail there. That was so close. But like, if I didn't bonk on that NPC, I'm like so comfy there. I read about Octavius's attack, but somehow I didn't believe it. Blames me for Rosie's death. Where did all my height go there? Surprise. Got stolen. God, cha okay, chapter 11 really is the juicy time save on these splits. Hello, uh, I'm not sure how to pronounce your name. But, welcome. So the gamer jump... ...is... ...a jump to get from one of the camera tokens in chapter 6 to the other one. And if you do it without bonking on a wall, it's the gamer jump. And if you don't, then you're not a gamer. Yeah, I unfortunately do not know how to read Russian. Sometimes I barely know how to read English. Actually, not true. I, I did pretty well. I did pretty well at English in uh, in school. Although I didn't learn a lot of the formal rules. I just read a lot until I understood. You know the one? Yeah. That's the gamer jump. Now you know. So, how did you find Shocker? Well, apparently he escaped during your little event Seriously? I was... I don't think I was almost an English major, but I had thought about it. Still, I was a little um, distracted at the time. Because I wanted to be an author for a bit. But I think by the time that I was choosing majors for college, I was over that. I think by then I wanted to make video games. Or I guess... You know what? No, I wanted to be a software programmer, because I didn't think making video games would, was something that I could do. And then I realized I was wrong. So there, there's some Sly Finkleton lore for you. How far is this place? Gotcha. College is hard, and the funny part is, like, a third of what makes it hard is the classes. <laughs> Isn't that weird? I guess that's kind of life, right? So, uh, nice night, huh? No oh, the pull swing. Really cool, but I do need to move faster than that. What did I bonk on? I just went up for no reason. It's so funny that getting this token is a strat again, because that was a strat years ago. And now it's back. Sometimes things are... Cyclical like that, I guess. It's just 
completely different context. That's one. It's two. Three. Four. Five. Oh, he tricked me so hard. He waited so long to jump. And then he waited until I swung so I couldn't hit him. I got outplayed, straight up. But you always get chakra skip so quickly. At a cer certain point, you just gotta go ham. You know what I mean? Like, I am sacrificing a small amount of consistency by going that fast, but like, it's... The seconds are worth it. You just gotta get in the mindset of like, okay, this run's not gonna PB unless I go this hard anyways, so I might as well. I wonder what Shocker's planning. I'd say even with that, my consistency is probably still somewhere around 80%, maybe a little higher. It's a renamed the Greasy Drop. All right, but if you if you rename it that, it's stuck as that. Keep posing, Betty. It is really funny that there is a name for a move that's only that's done not e not even in one category, just in one goofy challenge run that I did like two years ago. Great. Now to get these photos for the bugle. No. Yeah, yeah, Mysterio skips really hard. T-posing, buddy. I can't believe that. Jameson would frame his own mother if he thought it would sell papers. I will admit, for a while, what did I ever do to like, leading up to the GDQ run a couple years back, I, like, really wanted to, to basically just straight up lie about it, <laughs> being this... A skip and just like if you didn't know that part of the game was just like that um like like i was gonna say like i was doing like a button combo to like hit him quick enough so that i get him before his health bar is technically full yeah i'm on it <laughs> and then not correct myself and then i was like that's a little i don't know I, I shouldn't just be like spreading information even if it's funny Lying on the internet can be fun, but you gotta do it in a balanced way. And I feel like that was that would have been like just barely unbalanced. I will say, um I've been, I think I've said this once before. On that GDQ run, so I was running with, um, I was running on this old laptop that I had. Was my, I didn't have like a PC, a full PC set up yet. And the USB slot on, on, uh, that laptop was like bad and fucked up. Whoa, this is an old and laptop. it started acting up like a couple days before the run, where it would occasionally unplug my capture card. If, if the, if, if the laptop like moved at all. And for those of you that know how my capture card works, it was the same capture card. That's really, really bad in a marathon setting, because I would have to close my OBS program and start again. So, thankfully it didn't happen, but like, 
that that like was so nerve wracking because I was I was like if this happens in front of like sixty thousand people or however many what we're watching I don't remember then like the then that's really really bad <laughs> so thankfully it didn't happen oh I'm landing on that buoy what do you think am I landing on it I don't think I'm landing on it actually nope. Mary Jane's play. Maybe I can make it tonight. Booey strats are back, baby. Yo, Noir, thanks for stopping by to say hi. Future guys schedule. I feel like oh, hang on. Oh, cleanest fight you've ever seen there. <laughs> Maybe actually my best fight I've ever done there. Uh, what was I even saying? Oh, I don't have a schedule, so it feels like you're calling me out. I never, I like don't have, I don't ever use like a calendar unless it's like very something very important. I just remember that shit. Is it an AV capture, HDMI capture? This one actually does both. It does component and HDMI. At the time I was running it with component cables, but these days I run it with HDMI. Say calendar, balance, and challenge. Are you testing my accent? Are you gonna be like, you say it weird? Hey, cat. Cause I'm curious. <laughs> Yo, Mario fan. I don't know what causes this guy to go over here sometimes. I wish he didn't do that. Those are the only words you can hear in accent. I do think it's funny when people say I have an accent, because like obviously I do, everybody does, but you know, you don't hear that in your day-to-day -day life very often. Okay, Spider-Man, the robot's right there. You gotta hit him. <laughs> oh, it's this guy. Fuck this guy. Get out of here. <laughs> cool if you ask about the AV part. Like, with my capture card? Yeah, go ahead. What about the people in my life? How would they feel? It isn't like anyone ever sees me now. MJ. Harry. Aunt May. Oh. What am I doing? What? No matter how I just forgot you about... Can't okay, I'm like too tired for this. <laughs> I straight up forgot about Scoopus Skip. I am getting tired. This is definitely the last run of the day. But I'm gonna finish it out. No. I can't quit either. Help so many people. This is an accidentally long stream. I just kind of lost track of time. But I can't give up being Spider-Man either. But I'm down. Maybe I can balance the two. I should track down Black Cat. I need to have a talk with her. Every time I use an AV card, the audio gets out of sync. I can do it. It, it does happen with this capture card sometimes when it gets disconnected. Maybe I can be and I think it used to happen to me when I was running on that laptop that wasn't powerful enough. So that might be what hap what's happening. Is like, um, either it's getting disconnected somehow, every once in a while, or your computer is lagging. Or that capture card just does that, because some capture cards just do that. Yeah, without scuba skip, what you just um, saw kind of was the strat for a while was just hang out there. What was I thinking? I must have looked totally crazy. Things could never work out. What See, this is why I couldn't stream for eight hours every day. Like, 
I'm tired. <laughs> I should just keep away from her. At least she's still at Harry. I mean, it is getting late at night, but even if I started earlier, I think I would still be tired. You can sync via delay on stream, um, but I'm assuming Maggie is talking about is the type of lag that kind of builds up over time. Like, like it starts out in sync, and then slowly over the course of hours of recording, or even not that long, it just gets out of sync, which is a lot harder to fix with delay because it's changing. Mary Jane must beat me for freaking out on her like I did the other night. That that glide is so hard to hit. I'm actually surprised I only lost that much time. Now that I think about it, other than just forgetting that scuba skip exists, that chapter 14 had some good parts. Like that that Mary Jane Alley fight was probably the best I've ever done that. Any good runs tonight? There were some promising ones. I wouldn't say there were any, like, exceptionally good ones. But I've been... I've been unveiling new strats this stream, so that was the exciting part. Yeah, all that I can say, Maggie, is it's probably either your computer or your capture card, so... I don't know if you have a way to replace one of them and see if it works, but... Capture cards are annoying. I kind of wish I didn't need to use one for this game. And I am thinking about getting a new one. It's just, you know, they cost money. And this one still works. So, with an asterisk. <laughs> works quotation marks but uh, this capture card's like how old even is it it's got to be getting close to 10 years right it's at least like seven or eight you can even do different more damaging moves I think my idea for a new strat with that train is to not do slow-mo between the hits. Which will do more damage, give me more slow-mo bar, and just take less time in general. But that shit sounds really hard, and I'm definitely going to need to like grind it to figure out how to do it. Because that's going to change how the gravity works in that fight. I forgot that that window could open that way. That's one. How many of these things does he have scattered around this place? I thought I had time to maybe get around the corner. In the PB run, I got up here before that happened, so I was that much faster. Got to go, can't stay for long. I mean, this is the end of the last run, so <laughs> you pretty much stuck to, to the end. Sub 50 happens, that'll be the end of 80%. We'll have to see. I, I think we'll know... We'll have to re-evaluate when that happens. Why did I jump? Why did that miss? Why did that not hear a punch? Weird fight. Die! Fuck you! <laughs> that was almost a 53. That's wild. What have we done? What have I done? Dr. Weird Arcane. fight, but fun run. Stop that reactor before it's too late. This is bad. There's only one thing to do. 
I'm excited. The, the fire is burning pretty hot for the grind right now. I, I'm feeling the passion. My hubris, my vanity cost Rosie her life. I think I must set things right. Once I get that art gallery stat strat down. I think we're gonna be looking pretty good. And I was I had some good I had one really good run of it today. But regardless. They died. We're gonna wrap up today. I'm not. I'm like 50 50 on whether I'm streaming tomorrow. We'll see. We'll see. But if not hey, tomorrow. Congratulations. Welcome to part two. Then Check definitely the. What's, the wait, what's the day after tomorrow? To Thursday? <laughs> definitely <laughs> Thursday. Um, hey, yeah, thanks so everybody for watching. I had a great time. Shout outs to some schmuck for the super chats. Uh, and Big Lion for hopping on as a member. Appreciate it. As well as the rest of the members. But mostly thanks everybody for watching and hanging out. And I'll maybe see you tomorrow. And wishlist my game. Links in the description. Peace.